Guys, do you like your coffee or tea with sugar or no sugar? Fellers, not to uh, flex or anything, but uh, I'm going to try some of this gamer tea. The light's a bit bright. I don't know if you can see it, but yeah, that's good enough. They have tea bags, just like that. Look, focus. I'm going to go make that real quick. Stay right where you are. Grab some something to drink or eat. I don't know. I'm putting my Resident Evil mug to use today, for the first time in months, I think. Okay. Ooh. Actually, wait, 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 hold on. Because I know this bothers some of you, I'm gonna make my bet. Or, well.
Okay. Look, bed made. Are you guys proud of me? So this is the Resident Evil mug I was talking about. Uh, hold on, let me just turn it over. I really like this mug. It's uh, simple, but looks cool. Do we have any RE fans in chat, actually? Thank you, Lester. <laughs> Thank you, Max. <sighs> okay. Guys, did you make your own bed? That's the question. You're always like, Leon, fuck you, make your own bed. What about you? Did you do it? I bet you didn't. So this is the so-called gamer tea right here. Hashtag ad, by the way. <laughs> Yo, Frosty, thank you. Thank you. Yo, Resource, how you doing? <laughs> yes, Leon, I did. Okay, good job, chat. Good job. Man, it's been a while since I had anything related to gamer subs. Uh, can you even... I don't think you can see it, but there's like a tiny logo for the teabag. Yeah, it's been a while since I had anything from them. Like, I actually have stuff right here, but I just never drink. What is Plink? You see that? You see that cat over there? The, the silly cat staring at the monitor, staring at you and me? That's the Plink. Oh wait, I'm assuming you don't have the... Uh, <laughs> Uh, the extension for the browser, do you? You should download it. It's going to enhance your um, streaming experience. <sighs> Rizcat, yeah. Dude, it's literally four in the morning for me. America, if you like. Better TTV, yeah. And I think if you do that, you're going to be able to access the rest of the emotes. Hold on, let me show you. If I can. So it should look something like this. Once you have the thing installed, just look at all, look at all the emotes. Animated, static, you have it all. I think you have to enable it from up here, though. Yeah, better TTV settings. But yeah, once you get the extension, then you're good to go. Yo, Maxis, good. How are you doing? safe oh it's safe a lot of people use it um pretty much all the streams on twitch like people have that it's like it's like downloading steam look at how many plinkers there are in chat wait hold on let me uh bring you guys over here let's install i mean won the game So, if you missed it, the last time we played, we got to two stars on, on the resort. Two out of five. So, I'm not sure how far in we're going to make it today, but should be fun. Thank you, Hidden One. Ichiban is a grown man, yet still sees the world as Dragon Quest. Hey, leave him be. Leave him be. He can be a man-child if he wants to be. Guys, do you like Ichiban more, or do you like Kiryu more? I should really add stuff to the room, but like, I need more stuff to be available. Uh, finished Infinite Wealth, and now I don't have to be afraid of spoilers. Yep, welcome. Mm -mm -mm -mm. K 
can't decide, they're both good. Itchy has been growing on me, not gonna lie. Yeah, I like both of them. Like, the only reason I would probably say I prefer Kiryu is because he had more games, so more development. But also, Kiryu's development kind of went places, if you know what I mean. <laughs> yeah, Ichiban infected Kiryu with the Dragon Quest virus. Okay, so we do have guests. Red or green mascot? The guy on the left. Man, I always have the popularity down. We just need... Right, right, so... The fields, where... where is that? Oh, actually, wait, 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 wait. We can build a bridge now. The red mascot looks hideous. That thing could appear in my closet any time. Yeah. <laughs> can he convert yen to dokubux? I don't think so. That would be a little busted, I think. Yeah, see, Ray? Now, now you have the power of Plink. Doesn't it feel good? <laughs> God, I love BTTV. You have a lot of other emotes, too. A scheme. Can we get some cat jams right now? Please? I said please, too. So you have to do it. Hey, look at the cat jammers. <laughs> we have a sad cat jammer. We have a couple of static cat jams. It feels wrong to take off the static cat jams at this point, because, like, there's something of a meme, and, uh... Like, I don't know. They, they... They were the OGs on my channel. Hi. <laughs> Look at all the cat jammers. And the few plinkers who refuse to cat jam. <laughs> uh, the cat jam's not static, they're just moving too slow. Yeah. <laughs> they sure are taking their time. Yo, Justin, how you doing? Hi. So wait, you don't... Make a bridge for that? Hey. He's wearing the host fit. Do you like it? I've recently started a playthrough of Gaiden. <clears throat> Halfway through, so far so good. Yeah, glad you're having fun. Genova. <laughs> Do you think there's a chance Gaiden is gonna get New Game Plus? No. 
I feel like if that was gonna happen, it would have happened with the dub update, which it didn't. <clears throat> yeah, this is the new Animal Crossing. Is this gonna be a cup base of the Ishin mini game? I hope not. Well, I mean, you know, I, I still didn't get around to doing that, Nishin. Hi. What happened in the big swell? Uh, do you mean like the general premise of it, or like how it ends, or? <laughs> uh, sorry, Devil Leon, you're gonna be relegated to background noise. I welcome it. In fact, I'm I'm thrilled about that. Guys, please. Make me your background noise. I'll take it. Hi. <laughs> oh no. General premise. Uh, you come across this dungeon with a party. Um, and every time you beat the floor, you get a slice of life anime with the party. If only we knew any able-bodied men who can constantly boast about their physical strength. <sighs> no way a guy like that exists. Playing Yakuza while listening to Leon play Yakuza. You can never have enough Yakuza. Hell yeah. Mm. Playing Ace Attorney. Oh, nice. Oh. Why the hell do we have to work in the dang crop patches? Uh, my schedule's packed. I just played 4, 5, 6 basically back to back for the first time. Nice, what do you think of them? Isn't 5 an epic game? Oh, now, nah, okay, now nah, <laughs> he's gonna help her. Once he sees the ladies, he's sold. Hey. Hello, ladies. My name is Yasuo Sudachi. I'm prepared to spend the rest of my life here until the day I die. <laughs> nice, dude. <laughs> Uh, 5 was great, was refreshing after the absolutely abominable plot in 4. I'm pretty sure the Yakuza 4 plot gave me brain damage. <laughs> hey, come on. The Yakuza 4 plot may be bad, but it's funny. <laughs> Just bought Yakuza 3 on sale, is there any tips or things to watch out for? Yeah, so... A lot of people call Yakuza 3 Blakuza, because they block a lot, I guess. Um, I don't know what difficulty you play these games on, but if you play on normal, you'll be good. Um, I don't know how skilled you are either, so... Just, you know, like the usual, stock your inventory with healing items. And if you run into, run into the too much blocking problem, uh, make use of grabs or dodge behind enemies to attack them. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh yeah, six is pretty easy. The drop kick makes everything easy. Um, I love you because of Forest Plot because I don't remember anything except rubber bullets and balls out. So I'm surprised every replay. <laughs> Sounds about right. It feels like every replay of Yakuza Four. I learned something new about Arai. Um, Sejimon... Workshop to earn doko bucks, crop patches to harvest vegetables... Training spot... Okay... Huge gains! Your friendship with the Sejimon... 
Absolutely nothing gave me trouble on <laughs> 6 hard mode for some reason. 6 is just easy. Um, you have multiple tools to deal with uh, stuff. Okay. Isn't that the spot for that one revelation? I'm pretty sure it is. Also, what the hell are you guys doing there? So your active Sujimon party just hangs around? Gold ore? Oh. Golden trash bags, I guess. Turtle! Uh, my opinion... The Yakuza games are the best combat as Gaiden. Yeah, fair enough. When it comes to combat, I feel like Gaiden is a mixed game for people. I've seen people say it's like... Still horrible combat, and I've seen people say it's the best. Golden Hopper. You can raise your friendship bonds with the active Sijimons here. I see. Hey, buddy. Sijimon, best friends forever. Emotes, okay. Did he just... Did he just touch them? Bro, that's assault. Okay. <laughs> I think it depends if you jive with K2 combat or not. It's kind of... Like, I don't even know if I should put K2 combat on the same pedestal as Gaiden, because... Doesn't Gaiden get rid of, like, the attack knockbacks on block completely? That makes Gaiden... Way better. Automatically. There's a lot of bugs here, goddamn. Oh god damn it. Do we have a shop here or no? Do we or like do we have to go all the way back? Uh, please tell me you don't have to go back. Does anyone know? Storage box. What okay, what about a shop? I want a shop. Um, you have to go back, okay. Steve, how are you doing, buddy? What do you think of the Chinese dub? I didn't hear too much of it. It seems decent, though. What do you guys think of the Chinese dub? Steve is enjoying a vacation on the island. I think from what I heard of the Chinese dub, some songs are really cursed. Karaoke. Upgrade your bag to carry more items. I I hope so. 
that's one thing that kind of became a pet peeve for me. There's a lot of big fish here. Like he can upgrade the bag. Oh, that's a shame. That's pretty expensive for a fish. Perry, how are you doing? I really enjoyed Infinite Wealth, it's my favorite game. Nice. Hey, buddy. Belly rubs. <laughs> you, sir, are a fish. Me? Do we have any fish in chat right now? It's okay, you can say it. I think one of the Sujimon is missing. Where is he? The red one. There's a lot of mushrooms in here. I like seven story more than eight, but that's just me. No, I think that's the majority. Because I, well, I think seven had a better story too. I got a comment yesterday on my tier list video saying I don't get how people say LJ has a worse story than uh, Judgment. And I feel like worse is a big word. I wanted to comment on the, well, reply to the comment, but I didn't. Um, I don't think it's worse, per se. It's just that I find the first game more personal, and that means more development for Yagami, you know? And also, I do I do think I prefer the main villain of the first game over Kuwana. But, other than that, LJ is a very solid game. Amazing story. Yeah, a lot of the voices. Uh, I need to go greet the uh, guests, actually. Cycling center. Um, okay. So, wait, how do you know the right element for this? Oh, wait. I'm assuming the ones with, like, the star icon are the best ones. Select a course. Oh. Oh. You can't use the DLC Sujimons, man. That's a shame. So you just pick the same element and you're good to go? Is that a tiger Sigimon DLC? Yes. And a bear too. 
Okay. Friendship matters, I see. Look at them. <laughs> Barely the rubs for everybody. I can't talk to the other two. Sign Sujimon. Mm. Oh, cool. Uh, yeah, I'll just probably check that later. I'm gonna go back to the uh, other place. Man, I need to sell stuff. The Kufarn feels like if Nele Island had a good ending. Yeah. Okay, I have a bunch of fish to sell as well. I have almost a million, goddamn. <laughs> I think uh, we can go and set that bridge up now. Actually, wait, let me greet the uh, guests first. Yo, Adrian, yeah! Gotta get that early Dondoku stream. It feels like you don't have time to do much the more you unlock. Two hundred thousand. Take my money. What time is it for you? It's 1.40 p.m. right now. What time is it for you guys? Is it nighttime or daytime? That's a big one. Marlin! Yeah, I think I saw... Yeah, there's a few pirates here. Takes a bit to set up, but once you have more time, you'll have more time once you reach five stars. I see. What country? I'm in Bahrain. Bahrain. The Dread Marauder. Okay. Days of pollution are over. 
やってやるぜバーレインや。Damn you, Ichiban Kasuga. They actually have new animations for enemies on the Bingo Way. That's cool. This lake and shack look familiar. Maybe it's just my imagination. The lake is now open. You can obtain plenty of local specialties here every day. Okay. Win a battle at the lake. Okay, where are the fields? Golden Zinger. Hot pepper. Wait, do you also have to clean this lake? I don't see a meter. Firefly. You need to build a bridge for the fields. So, wait, is that the. Gonna have to check the next day. Isn't the Dondoka combat stiff as hell? Yeah, it is. Though I didn't expect, like, groundbreaking DMC combat. It's okay for what it is. Eel. Have you guys ever had eel? I actually can't remember. I might have had a sushi with eel, but I could be wrong. Mahi mahi. What the hell is that? <laughs> Full inventory. Yo, it's pr it's pronounced Seelacanth, I think. That's uh, that's a new one for me. Mm. How is Bahrain? Very humid. If you hate humid places, you're not gonna like Bahrain. Otherwise, though, it's a nice place. Like, being tiny as hell has its uh, perks. One of them being pretty much all the shops in the goddamn country will have home delivery. Hmm. 
またお役に立ちたいです Maybe all the shops is a bit of a stretch, but you know, most places, like if you want something delivered, you're probably gonna find it somewhere. Uh, oh wait, we need to destroy rocks. Is there a Millennium Tower in Bahrain? We have a couple of buildings close enough, actually. Then you have Australia, where the country is big as hell. Yeah. Yuto. Big countries in general. Like, the idea kind of... Gives me, um, an anxiety. I can see how hot your place by how bright your room is. Hey, my room might be... Well, that, but... Nah, no, I, I can't argue with that. Like, you have to deal with heat and humidity where I live, so it's not fun during the summer. But, like, during summer, pe people... Well, I say people, but... I mean me. <laughs> I don't leave anyway, but then again, I, I don't leave, like, most of the year, so... Uh... Is the resort mode fun? Yeah, I like it. If you like, you know... Cozy games in general, you're gonna love it. Yeah, yeah. Sate, sate. Eh, Impossible to survive without a. Yeah, I mean, having an air conditioner here is a must in every house. Mezase! You can imagine my surprise when, like, when I was a kid, and I heard that it's not the same with other countries. Golden egg. Hmm. <laughs> You only on do mascots annoy you? Like in general? Not really. Do you use this for anything? Does anyone know? The golden eggs? My Steam is downloading a new update for Infinite Wealth. Oh shit. Maybe they fixed the permanent stat uh, buffs or something? Hold on. Let me check social media real quick. Uh, I don't think I see any post from them, but six gigabytes. What is that? Yeah, maybe it's that free DLC they were talking about then, but still, six gigabytes. I don't know if I want to restart my game now. <laughs> Knowing my connection, it might take like a couple hours on stream. But if it's off stream, it should be quick. Okay, I don't see any patch notes or anything. Hold on. Infinite Wealth update. The missing chapter, yeah. <laughs> I don't see anything. I'm assuming it, like, just, just came out, like, a few seconds ago. So, wait, are, are we tripping, or... 
Is this real? Are we getting trolled right now? Okay, I don't see any updates in my downloads, but that's probably because I'm playing the game. Can anyone else confirm? I quit DVD, and boom. Okay, those who have Steam, can you... Oh, someone else confirmed it. I guess we have to wait for them to say what's included. Okay, okay, well. Uh, 5.6 gigabytes. So wait, are those the fields? Maybe? 200,000. Take my money! That suit suits Ichiban, I'm gonna lie. Yeah, it's pretty nice. New area! Got an update on PS5, but only 386 me megabytes. What? I joined the stream to see gameplay, your guys' opinion. Wait. And your guys' opinions on Infinite World. Because me personally, if the story and content is good, I might buy it. The story... See, I, I think most people say the story is good until the ending. Then people get mixed. But gameplay, it's like a direct improvement over 7. So if you enjoyed 7, you're gonna love this game. I think overall, as a package, this game is better than 7. It's just its uh, just a shame what they did with the DLC. Sato Naka, the Dread Invader. Largest area on Nondoka Island. I need to be careful. My health is yeah, limited. Or finite, I should say. No, dodge! Alright, we did it! Yeah, we don't have infinite health, feels bad. What level am I? What level do you need to be by the end of the game? For Ichiban's party, if you're like level 48, you'll be good. For Kiryu, it's like 52-ish. Just make sure you have decent weapons. That's the most important part. Um, he can be underleveled by one or two levels, that's fine. But you need weapons or, and like good armor. Huh? I kind of hated the combat switch of 7. Well, here's what I have to tell you about that. I've had people in my chat who played 7, they hated the game, or they didn't like it. And then those same people came in and they told me, Hey Leon, I played 7, didn't like it, but I played Infinite Twelfth and I love the game. So maybe trying this game out is going to be a different experience, but that's for you to uh, gauge. <sighs> okay. This is me. I feel like the level difference between you and the enemy in 7 is way harder than in 8. I was saying that. Yeah, I was saying that yesterday. Most of my chat at least had an easy time with this game. Do you have uh, Gaiden, Dan? I don't know if you played the demo, but maybe that's gonna give you a taste. At least gameplay-wise. Oh, 
Um, if you beat Gaiden, you can have that demo, so you, you get a good taste of what to expect. Yo, Timotheus. This game doesn't have difficulty spikes like Majima and Saijima in 7. I think I've heard of a few people who did have a problem. One of them is uh, Gokidoni. But man, RPG games I feel like are hit or miss depending on how you approach the game. Because there's so many possible ways you can play the game. You'll have someone who will stop and farm every chance they get. You'll have someone who doesn't do anything and just tries to progress with the story. And then you have someone who tries to mix, like do a bit of side stories and continue. And then how much of the side stuff they do, that's also a big um, variable, basically. Oh, that's a huge area, goddamn. I'm sad this is the last Kiryu game. Buddy, they keep saying that every single time. Don't worry. Kiryu is gonna come back in 9. I'm sure they're gonna address the patch notes in a, a post at some point, but... Wait, how do you go, go in there? Wait, oh, there's another... Okay, okay, okay. I see. I've seen too many steamroll the trio because they were 10 to 20 levels over level. God damn! That's a, <laughs> that's a big difference. Honestly, though, I don't think that's completely horrible. Depending on you, of course. Someone might prefer to do that fight under leveled, and some, you know, they hate having to extend the length of, a, of any fight by like 10 or 20 minutes. Um. See, like, god, there's so many variables when it comes to RPG games in particular. It's insane. Wait. But I better increase our resort rank first. So wait, we can't even clear most of that yet? I always like to overlevel in JRPG. Yeah, Walker, same. Oh, we need more stars, okay. So basically, we can't really optimize that area yet. Okay, unassuming eatery in a bar. <laughs> Would you say RGG is hinting at retiring Kyrgyz era of characters in this game? Uh, I have it. There is no telling. Like, they'll just do whatever they want. Yakiniku restaurant. <laughs> Anything is possible, Lee Frimo. I'm not sure. Chinese restaurant. Ebisu.
Hell yeah, let's make one. Free info booth. Do you think Kiryu will beat the cancer? Very possible. Okay, she's already super happy. I need to put chairs here. Uh... So wait, if you put one of these, can you remove them and, you know, revert it back to grass or no? Yeah, Roxy. You can, okay. Yo, Mr. Devil. Uh... Oh, yeah, you can just... I'm... So, you're gonna buy it on Steam, then? Yeah, you can just refund it if you don't like it. Uh... Still saving money for the game? You got this. So, hold on. Wait, what the? Actually, no, wait, what am I doing? Uh... I guess I have to remove the objects first. Okay, let's put uh, this bad boy. I think I need to remove one of the umbrellas. Uh, I did complete the big spell, yeah. Um, did you see that RE4 Remake Old Edition released today? Oh, is it today? It's kind of a shame, though, that has nothing new to it. Like, not even... I don't know, a weapon or something. Nothing. Kinda sucks. And I heard Europe ha only Europe has the physical release for that edition. Which is, again, kinda weird. Uh... Man, what do I wanna do? This is a restaurant, karaoke place, a DVD place. Now maybe we need to place something here. There we go. Unassuming eatery. The island's theme is now pop. Okay. These three months stream labs. I don't know how you keep reading chat. I do have a second monitor, yes. I don't think it's uh, a good time if you don't have a second monitor. You know what I used to do? Hold on. I think before buying a second monitor... Well, 
What I used to do was, um, I would grab my phone, um, open that, open chat, and just put it next to me. That's how I used to read chat, but um, I'm so glad I got a second monitor. Uh, it helps a lot. Yeah, that's the budget way. I said they didn't add the assignment Ada with the gold. Yeah, they could have done that, or just anything. My stupid ass queen saver. Yeah, I mean, same, same. I did the best thing I could do. I made it so that every 10 minutes, um, it turns off. I can't do anything beyond that. So every, like, five minutes or so, I would just tap on the screen. But yeah, it is annoying. It really is. No patch notes out. I hope they don't take long with that. Wait, hold on. Hmm. Okay, hold on. Let me... Can't wait, really? Why, like, why can he not fill that one square? Well, I guess we don't need to, but yes, yeah, so, like, what's up with that? Why can he not do that? Mild inconvenience, yeah. <laughs> uh, sure, I guess. Let's just make that. Uh, we need to buy a fence as well. Wait. Okay. Um... But he can't... Bruh! Oh, why not? Uh, well... Yeah, I mean, honestly, might as well just use this without any special floor. Um... Maybe that specific square was fixed on the new patch. Maybe. Okay, I need to get some chairs from the storage. I'm pretty sure I had some. Or maybe I should craft uh, new ones, actually. Mm. Yeah, let me go to the crafting station. I guess those work. Or those. This seems kind of uncomfortable, though. Okay, orange fast food chair or white chair? I'll go with the. No, actually. Okay. 
I didn't see you play the story much. Uh, was the game polished? I would say it is. There, like, there's a few oddities, like, you know, getting rid of the skill shortcut system, but otherwise, there's a lot of quality of life um, stuff made. Wait, what? Why? Why do they have to be so far away? What? <laughs> Dude, <laughs> come on now. Okay, I guess they're just gonna sit like 10 meters away from each other. Why not? This is so fucking awkward. <laughs> but hey, why? <laughs> okay, I guess. Yeah, quarantine distance. Goddamn. I mean, I guess it's not that bad, but I mean, look, look at this. I'm assuming the umbrella does something. That's why. Like, there's a hitbox for the umbrella, see? I'll take it, I guess. Um... They need to be next to the path to give you bonus stats. Oh, do they? Hmm. Okay, so this is a food stand. Oh, this is kind of... Reversed. Hold on. No, I didn't... Oh, God damn it. There we go. There we go. Anybody want some chicken, uh... What did, what did they call them? Karage, I think? Nice te textures, Ichiban. Thank you, Sam. Um... I hope Yama is in the next game. I feel like he definitely will be. Okay, I... There's something I want to do, but I forgot what it was. So if you're placing it right, it shows... I see. Please tell me they added Akame in this game. Are you kidding me? Of course not. <laughs> Why would they ever bring back a character like that? Um... Okay, we need to increase the satisfaction somehow. Mm, I guess putting more buildings? I need, oh, I need to put stuff here too. I keep forgetting about that. Man, that's what I mean when I say I feel like you don't get enough time in a day. For, for now at least. Kinda sucks he won't be playable because they will never let you play as a murderer. Well, hey! Ryuji was playable in Dead Souls. I know it's a spin off, but. I'm not sure, Galaxy. I'm wondering the same. This is up. Any character you want playable in 9? I want Yamai and Sawashiro. I'd love Yamai as well. Sawashiro, I think, isn't gonna happen. I'll, I, I would take it, though. I'll, I'll take that. Um, I hope, if not most of the characters in this game are playable. Wait, if not all of them, then most of them at least. I hope they don't let go of... Uh... I was gonna say Tomizawa and Chitose. Chitose is probably gone, given, you know, what happens in the ending. Tomizawa coming back would be awesome. And Sonhi. I would love for them both to come back. Yes, 
Pocket Circuit Fighter, okay. Actually. Okay. Got spoiled? Well, it's okay. I didn't say what happens to her. Oh yeah, you might want to turn off the stream. <laughs> mm. Okay. Okay, so I need to place more buildings. Wait, that's the bar, I think, right? Wait, that's the same place. Isn't that Hamako's place? I'm pretty sure it is. Yeah, I... Here's the thing about spoilers, like, I can't get upset at people tuning in and, like, seeing, you know, side stuff and, like, and then out of nowhere a story thing drops, but also, it is a post-game stream, so expect anything to happen. I think at this point Ryuji's alive. Well, he wasn't there in the funeral event. So, maybe he is. I need to make more souvenirs. I've seen someone who hated Namba learn to love him. I I've seen someone who hated Namba learn to love him in Infinite Wealth. Yeah? I still do think the whole Namba arc in 7 was pretty good. It was an example of a believable uh, betrayal to me at least. If you have a problem with that particular betrayal arc, or hell, if you have a problem with Chitose's betrayal arc, and you don't have a problem with, say, Baba's betrayal arc, I think you might you might need to reevaluate some things there. <laughs> I think that's still one of the most awkward betrayal arcs, in my opinion. Also, you know what I just thought of? Um, you know how people, including me by the way, have a problem with the whole AG arc? L like how Ichiban really wanted to uh, see the best in him and all that? Um, I just randomly thought of Oda, of all fucking people. And how Kiryu, you know, I'm not, I'm not gonna say he liked him, but... In those moments where he was punching Chibisawa, he thought of Oda. So, <laughs> you know, <laughs> this history is not a stranger to questionable, um, forgiveness. 
Even then, I would I wouldn't say kill you for gave Oda, but still. For me, Saika was the least interesting character in eight. Yeah, she didn't have, really have much to do compared to the other characters. Honestly, I don't dislike how they handled Psycho in this game, because it felt like a pretty believable inclusion. Like she was, you know, occupied with her job until some stuff with her friends came up, and she's just tagging along to help them out. I actually like that. It feels mundane in a way that's believable. Psycho came up as petty to me. There's someone else who came in yesterday and said the exact same thing. God damn. I don't, like, I don't mind what they did with Psycho, like, you know, the whole Ichiban and Psycho thing. But it did feel a little, uh, exaggerated. Yakuza has the best physique in your opinion, Leon. Have you seen Adachi in this game? God damn, bro. I wish I looked like that when I'm 60, what, 3? It's a little sad because aren't they friends at least? That was cold. Yeah, I do agree with that. I think Infinite World had the best version of Kiryu since I always felt like he's at his best as a mentor character. Yeah, I really liked his portrayal in Infinite World. I did. Um, I've seen an interesting take though about Kiryu and Ichiban, Ichiban saying that they didn't interact enough in this game. I, don't, I, feel, I feel like they did. Because, I don't know, what, what more would you have added? Adachi actually has a scary good physique. It's <laughs> unbelievable. <laughs> Kiryu in this game had a lot of reasons to feel uh, withdrawn, if you ask me. And even then, Ichiban kind of brought something out to him, you know? There was another discussion that I saw. So you know how in that uh, bucket list thing, I don't know if I can, yeah, I don't think I can open that now. In one of the bucket list um, entries, uh, Kiryu says he's jealous of Ichiban and how he's uh, good at uh, uniting people. Remember that? I've seen someone say that uh, Kiryu is kind of blind to the fact that he also is a good leader who unites people. But then I think about... <laughs> I think about the way Kiryu unites people, and I'm like, no, you know what, I think Kiryu does have a point in this one. Yeah, Kiryu does loathe himself a lot, or maybe not a lot, but he does loathe himself a bit. But they have very different approaches of uniting people. Kiryu, like, with Kiryu, it usually ends with, like, beating each other to a fucking... to a pulp. Think back to Daigo. Think back to... Like, I don't know, all the characters he meets. <laughs> It's always in a fight. With Ichiban, though, like, he, he uses... Um, 
a different kind of charisma. And like the bases, that argument used as well for like curious charisma was um, Aizawa's speech in Yakuza 5, where, you know, Aizawa mentions that Kiryu has a lot of charisma that draws in people. But again, I feel like they have very different charisma. It's not the same. So I still understand how Kiryu is jealous of Ichiban's particular leadership or charisma. Uh, Ichiban usually sees the best in people and, you know, talks it out with them. Kiryu's like, oh, you don't want to join forces with me? Punch. <laughs> How about now? <laughs> it's kind of funny. Yeah, the three Jimas, the Hiroshima goons, Rikia. Hell, Akiyama and Tanimura and Yakuza. Like, almost every single example, it's the same method he uses. Beat the shit out of whoever it is. Um. I think I should craft something. Oh, whoa. Oh, God damn it. I keep forgetting they have to take the bat down. Oh, did I greet them already? I think I did. What about Shinada? He's a broke man. He slapped Haruka and she became his daughter. True. See? <laughs> uh, favorite job? Probably assassin, but there's a lot of good ones. Free info booth. Where am I supposed to put all of these? Yeah, he beats up Oda before working under him. He beats up Kuze until Kuze respects him. There's there's a clear pattern. Mm. Yeah, resource same. What about Date? Uh yeah, he doesn't hit Date as far as I remember. But that's one exception out of thirty people. Oh, that's a comfy chair. Um, let's see. Yeah, Shinji as well in Zero. Ryuji as well, sort of. Mine as well. Nishiki. Man. The island style is global. I see. Yeah, I should, I should add something like, uh... Actually, wait, wait. <laughs> Let me make that. <laughs> no, I haven't seen that, Randy. Yeah, Date gave him a cell phone, so he doesn't have to beat him up. Hmm... <laughs> Money plants. <laughs> A vintage film theater. What job is your favorite? Assassin, probably. <laughs> yeah, the base classes are really good. <laughs> Wait, actually... <laughs> I know what you're thinking. Leon, what the fuck are you gonna do with all that bread? Oh, just you wait and see. Oh, I need space, goddammit. The 
Okay, where... Oh, there we go. Oh, wait. Actually, I should take this as well. Is that plastic bread? I don't know. <laughs> Good question. Okay, here's what I'm gonna do. Uh, actually, I think it would be better to bring those a bit to the closer to the entrance and this a bit in the middle. Now, watch this. A perfect feast for all the guests. Um, I could put a cake somewhere, but I feel like it's gonna mess with the pattern. Now that's a guest table. Wait, what? Oh, wait. Let me add the... Uh... We also need to add a bin somewhere. Maybe here would not be a bad idea, but... Actually, no. Oh, hold on. And maybe one over here. Okay, what do we think of that? <laughs> I love it, if I do say so myself. Uh, let's add a plant somewhere. No leg room. In game, yeah, but that, that that's pretty good leg room over there, look at that. Unless, like, you stretch your leg all the way through or something. Pretty good, Winston. How are you, buddy? Um... Oh, we need to put that somewhere, too. On my gaming desk, maybe? Or here? I can barely see that. There we go. Uh, man, there needs to be something in the middle, but I don't know what it is. Uh, and I feel like we're still missing quite a bit to craft as well. So I can't really maximize or make the best out of my room yet. Put a forklift in the middle. <laughs> Actually, wait, 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 wait. Let me put the rest of my bread over here. A bread... A, a table of just bread. Uh, wait. Wait, where did... Wait, there's one bread missing. What? Or... No, 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 I'm, I'm tripping, I'm tripping. Okay. Oh, what's this? You ran out of bread? Don't worry, buddy. Just come back to this table and pick up some more. <laughs> okay. Hmm. I think our room is starting to look a little more... Uh... Interesting. Let's call it a day, actually. Ay, ay, ay. There's Arakawa Masato pictures later you can put on the walls, really. I need to buy wallpapers, actually. Hello, 
これはどうですかおお、だつ、かなウィンドウ、アイウォンドウ、アクシャリー。イーヴニングウィンドウ。There we go. Um, oh man, which one do we start with? Geometric flooring. Oh, I like that actually. Japanese style light. I think I like that one. Okay, let, me, let me go back to the room. Actually, yeah, let's go to the room for now. Uh, who else had to cut their finger in the series? Well, Ichiban, Kaito, Kuze, who actually did do it. Th there's a very minor goon in Yakuza 0. I think his name was Okabe, if I remember right. The real estate guy with Amono, if you remember. He also cuts his finger off screen. Um. Actually, I don't know about this one. I think it does look okay, but I feel like it's missing something. Ooh. Ceiling lights. Okay, wait. What if you just put a morning and a night when they're next to each other? That's a paradox. <laughs> By the way, I still can't craft a full bed, I don't think, can I? Oh yeah, that guy in Yakuza 1 from the Shimono family. The wood wallpaper adds flavor. Do you guys like it? It might look empty still, but I need to craft stuff. So, I didn't know the light is a... Oh. I didn't know the light was addable in, like, a different menu. I guess I'll get that. <laughs> Actually, let's buy this one. Wait, what's the difference between this and that? More lights? It's implied to- oh yeah, Takabe, you're right, yeah. That's why he has gloves on. There we go, that's something in the ceiling at least. Okay. Interesting lack of yakuzaing people when they mess up. <laughs> hmm. I guess we can have a steel rack, but what do we even put on that? Oh, I guess we could have uh, a table with cushions around it in the middle. But We could make a statue. That's a pretty low chair. Uh, do we even have enough to make a kitchen? I don't think we have like a stove or a fridge. 
That's a pretty comfy chair. <laughs> Does Ogita count? <laughs> Ogita got a whole arm removed, so maybe. He truly went beyond. I... I am a loser. I need to add that to the soundboard. Uh... Ooh! That might be comfy. I guess we can make one of these two. It does look like a T pose in Kiryu, yeah. Add the whole Shimano meeting rant from Yakuza 1. There's a rumor. This looks kind of cool. Maybe we, we could add that in, in the middle. Like a whole mini Tojo meeting. Someone said add a forklift <laughs> to the room. We can do that. Um. Hmm. Okay, let's move out for now. Shoot the fingers off, Arakawa style. Man, that was such a good scene. What happened to Ichiban Confections? You know, just like the real estate, it disappeared. Well, it's still there, but Ichiban is no longer a CEO for some reason. Um. Let's go clean up that one area. Tatara channel happened, yeah. Ichiban chose the Giga Chat Shinada lifestyle over that, yeah. It's one thing to be forced in that lifestyle, but Ichiban chose that lifestyle. A true Sigma male. Okay, I should be careful. I'm just kind of going in. Board of Shale Holders demoted him because he's tried to sell New Game Plus as DLC. Yeah, that's the canon explanation. Tomizawa's gonna get one small mention like every next game and we'll never see him again. I have a bit of hope with Tomizawa. Because of Namba. I did not expect Namba to come back. Um, I was like, okay, this guy's a big deal in this story of Seven. But how are they gonna bring back a, like a, you know, an actual face model, like an actor? And they did, they just, they did that. So, there's hope for Tomizawa. Yo, Strayed, how you doing? Yo, 
Yeah, I really hope Tomizawa stays as well. We had Eri in 7, Eric in 8, and in 9 we'll have Erika. Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> She's gonna be a former CEO and a former taxi driver. Oh, I was like, wait, why is it uh, F? I entered another territory for a little bit. <laughs> Does some former CEO and former taxi driver also describe Kiryu? It does, yeah. Doing good, thank you for asking. I hope Joongi and Ja will stay playable at least. Oh, they're be they'll they're gonna be playable, all right. But well, just you watch. You're gonna get Zhao in the chapter before the last in Yakuza 9, and Joongi in the final chapter. <laughs> God. My biggest issue with the game is how late Joongi joined. Yeah. And like the audacity, he joins you for one part, and then leaves. But then joins you again soon after. But still. Though I'll say this, I, I do kind of like how the game acknowledged all of that. You know, when they pick Xiao with the Kiryu party, Jungi is like... I guess I'll sit here. <laughs> Like, he wanted to be, you know, with us for the adventure. I, I love that. It was adorable. And then he got so bored, he snuck off to Hawaii. That's actually kind of impressive. Is this as good as Animal Crossing? I never played Animal Crossing, so... I'm not the best person to ask. Animal Crossing fans, where you at? You have a DLK? Nice. Hope you have fun with that. Uh... Okay, I did ask about this before, but can you use the golden eggs for anything on the island, or can I sell them? Do you still think that Kiryu overshadowed Ichiban? A little bit, yeah. I, I do think he did a little bit. Just at the ending, I think. Uh, sell, okay. I'm gonna call away. Consider it how Jungi invented the shopping list to apologize to Sonhi when he gets back to Yokohama. Yeah. Oh, whoops, God damn it! Every single time. I do like how she probably wouldn't have minded at all that he went to Hawaii for that. She's a good leader. If 
you don't do the bucket list, carry you barely in the game. I can imagine, yeah. I did all of the bucket lists in my playthrough. Hawaii party versus Japan party. I love the Hawaii party, but I'm gonna have to go with the Japan party. What about you guys? I need to go to the other... wait. I need to go to the other uh, place for a little bit. Um, Hawaii Party is the chill group. Japan has the emo kids. <laughs> That's uh, one way to look at it. Uh, wait, where was the raft again? Oh, wait, 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 wait. Japan party because we have Kiryu and the Kiryu simp. Yeah. <laughs> Speaking of that, I really do like how they handled, you know, Sonhi's fondness of Kiryu. It's not like annoying, you know? It's just right, like, well balanced. Like, it's not uh, to the point where it takes away from her as a character. Ooh, nice. She basically respects the legacy Kiryu more than Kiryu does. Yeah. Oh, there's the red guy. Hey, buddy. Friendship up. I like how he just rubbed their chest and belly. Kiwami Red is adorable. Yeah, I like all of them. What the turtle doing? Buddy, you okay? What? Why do you look sad? Come on, tell us about it. Come on, we'll... Chat, you would listen to him, right? Buddy. I wish the turtle was also pettable. Yeah. Wait, what is quicksand? Oh. Yeah, that's that's a nice option. 
Turtle played the original Yakuza one with no upgrades. That's why he's sad. Understandable. Curious how they'll bring back Hawaii because there's no way they made this map for one game only. Yeah, I was saying the same thing. Same goes for Yokohama, by the way. Like, they made 7, and then what comes after that? Well, Judgment 2. <laughs> In Yokohama, because of course. So I'm sure they can do something. And by the way, when they announced Lost Judgment is going to be in Yokohama, I felt like that, that was such an ass pull. But like, it didn't bother me enough to the point where like I was okay, this game sucks. Would be wild if they made a sequel of Dead Souls in Hawaii. That would be wild. <laughs> They made a bunch of maps in 5 and ditched them. That is true, yeah. That is true. Oh. They also ditched uh, the Disco Mini game for good. Sawa Sensei opened the bar in Hawaii. <laughs> <laughs> oh, imagine that. The Ice Pick Bar. What do you guys think of that name? Onomichi did not come back either. Actually, you know where it came, ba came back? RGG Online. <laughs> and I'm not kidding. It came back for the Ryuji uh, story. Honda with a floaty to Dondoka Island. Yeah, that would be nice. I'll take it. And also the beach, Mine, with beach uh, Jungi. Very close to a million now. A million doko bucks. I'm rich. Uh oh. Hey, fellas. How do you recover health? Do you go to bed early? That's how. I might need to uh, do that. And by the way, I'm assuming time pauses if you go indoor. Does it? Oh yeah, eating souvenirs.
Having a healthy sleep schedule. Yeah. Who in the chat has a healthy sleep schedule? One's if you do, two if you don't. Oh, God. Every single time, man. I just want to say hi to them. Two. Oh, that's a lot of twos already. <laughs> No wonder you guys join my streams. <laughs> Ooh. Yeah, that's how Majima says hi. Yo, Kirana, how you doing, buddy? How you doing? Ban all the ones. <laughs> hey, come on. Even if you have a messy sleep schedule, you're still part of the... The... What do I call us? <laughs> the gang. A gold armchair. Oh wait, that's... Wait, is that a new space? Yo, Omega boy, thank you for the super chat, buddy. Thank you! Hey, Leon, I just got around to your last tier list. Got reminded of how many... How Yakuza 5 robbed me of valuable hours of my life. Am I stupid, or did Saejima really go back to prison, refuse parole, then just break out? <laughs> Listen, guys, please. You can't just come onto my stream and make me talk about Yakuza 5 again. Please. Thank you. No. <laughs> You're absolutely right on that one. <laughs> oh my god. That is something that I used to talk about, by the way. No, and the weirdest thing is he breaks out. When he talks to the guy supposedly responsible for the death of Majima, he's like, yeah, you know, if he got himself killed, then he was weak. Dude, you just got out of jail for this guy. Like, are you okay, Saejima? The cave area. I think I need one more star, don't I? Last I checked, I didn't need uh, to upgrade the resort. Um, that's why Nishitane got along so well with Majima. He was like Saijima and that... Yeah. <laughs> you can build it. Okay, hold on. I better increase our rank first. From Muku. So that's the one that I unlocked. But for that one, I need to increase the rank. Maybe the other bridge you're talking about? Hold on. I regret nothing. <laughs> Thank you, buddy. Thank you. Always a pleasure. Wait, but Saejima got out to kill Majima, right? Well... Kill. Yeah, in Yakuza 4. He just wanted to know what happens. Yeah, I need to increase my rank for this as well. Is there a third bridge somewhere you're talking about? Okay, I really need to increase the goddamn... Uh, ...satisfaction thing. Hold on. 15,000. Uh, I guess more buildings is what we need. Let's 
let's see. Free info booth. Sleazy. Taichi's gonna love this. In a film theater. <laughs> Cafe! Nice. Ramen cart. Oh, finally! Onomichio cutout. Uh, traditional Japanese building. Okay. Wait, where's the Tenkaichi Street sign? Am I blind? I think I'm blind. Uh... Oh, there we go. Let's craft... Uh, oh, that that's kind of hefty. Three of those. <laughs> Kyushu number one star. Roadside coffee shop. Okay, now we're getting some respectable shops. When do you unlock Dondoku? Chapter six, I think? Let's make the coffee shop. Oh, that's what I'm talking about. Ichiban Confections! Okay, a bus. Oh, Pach that can fuck off. Okay. I just put stuff all over the place and people apparently felt it was five-star <laughs> resort-worthy. <laughs> yeah. I can do that too, but... You know. You know, I'm gonna try to play legit. I had people in chat yesterday telling me they just put forklifts in the room. Okay, let's take this. I guess we need to get rid of that road. Wait, hold on. Wait, can he even delete this? I don't think he can. Or can you buy grass from the guy? I don't think I saw grass as an option though. Or maybe it's because this is close. Move camp and the cow. This is really stupid, but a path can't go through the gates. Bruh. Ooh, there we go. Okay. That's, that's good enough. This is totally something that people haven't already done, guys. Trust me. It's not like that's the first thing you think of doing when you get this gate. <laughs> yeah, the limitations seem annoying. Actually, putting a tent right next to the gate... Uh, ...sounds like it might not be the best idea. So... Instead of adding stuff to the... ...corners... Actually, I think this needs to be at a corner. Maybe over there. Actually, maybe we can put it back hit back here too. But there is a bar here. I'm thinking way too much about this. Is this the only time Infinite Twelve the the company's mentioned? No. Here you can go to the place and talk to uh, uh, the, the grandma over there. And I think one of the party members tells Kiryu about the experience. Build your own path onto the gate. 
No. I guess it doesn't work. If it's on the grass, I think it's fine, but... Wait. It's super specific, what the hell? Yeah, it's it's weird. Okay, so coffee shop. Roadside coffee. Doco box up. Mm. We could have a telephone booth somewhere around here. Mm, maybe this is not a bad spot. I think I need to move the bathroom somewhere else. Eri is in China, where Saijima went in Dead Souls. Yeah. How much longer are you going to be streaming? I don't know. Two, three hours, maybe? Maybe more? Ah, uh, okay. thought the statue would be way bigger. No, I think it's this size so that you can put it in any room as well. Hmm, what do we do now? I think we need to add a building or two. Actually, hold on, let me pause the time a little bit. It's time for a bit of a break. I think if I was talking to someone interested in this game, I'd say you should enjoy the journey more than the destination. Yeah? Well, the yeah, because it's usually about doing the side stuff. And, you know, having fun with that before you get to the end. What does the trident do? Uh, fishing. Okay, fellas? Small break time. Uh, if you want to grab water or something, now is the time to do that. I will be back in a few minutes. Few minutes. Okay? Few minutes.
Guys, no plinking allowed. Don't plink. Oh, god damn it. What did I guys, please. I told you not to do that and here you are. <laughs> okay. Okay. <sighs> Ichiban is itching his Ichibum. There he is. Guys, would you eat one of these? Or maybe one maybe that, a slice of that. Uh Maybe I should put that somewhere in here. Or, I don't know. We get the next star with this, so... Maybe one Kiryu statue on one side and Majum over here? I don't know. Okay. Da, 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 da. Where is Mr. Libido? He's in Yakuza Zero. Oh, happy birthday, Isaac. Or happy early birthday. In case I miss the actual day. It's my birthday in a week, actually. On the 16th. <sighs> Seems permanent stat... Oh, they're fixed, finally? Okay, that's good to know. Do they have the patch notes out yet, or no? What are you doing for the birthday? You don't want to know. <laughs> I don't do much for my birthdays. Like, usually what my dad does, um, every time it's either my birthday or one of my brothers, he's gonna treat all of us out to a restaurant. That's it. And you know, that that's good enough for me. Like, it doesn't take much to... Uh, to get me to be happy with stuff like that. Yeah, the best birthday uh, present I can get from you guys is a blink. Actually, no. Add the cat crunch to, uh, to that uh, as well. <coughs> Hell yeah, good meal is all I need for birth. Yeah, same. Pretty sure they're fixed. Remember my Ichiban HP being at 1550 HP. And now he's 1820. Nice. I need to disable the mod.
Oh, look at you guys with a birthday present. Thank you. Thank you, guys. My chat is the best. I think Mr. Shakedown got to see aliens. Maybe. <laughs> or maybe he got to see the Kappas, actually. Right, thank you, Mr. Isaac. Happy to serve with that one. Is there anything I can do right now? Oh, we can make a souvenir for the daily. Ooh, look at how beautiful that looks. Came for the plink, stayed for the crunch. Hell yeah. Oh yeah, we can make new souvenirs. Lucky turtle. Sure. Pasta a la dondoku. Hell stew. Oh, that's an expensive one. Heavenly stew. Okay, let's see what they actually do. Mm. Toxic. Oh, so we need the toxic shrooms for this. I'll try to save them then. What about the turtle? Dundaku stone. Okay. That's kind of cute. Uh... Pickles. Hell stew? More like. No, stream deck. No! Ah, oh, god damn it, dude. Watch, now it's gonna play randomly. Thank you, stream deck. Yo, Varys, thank you. Hope you're having a wonderful t t uh, day, too. <laughs> How long do you think it's gonna take to max rank all of the souvenirs? Ohio. Probably a good time, like a good while, but... This is up. Nice. A thousand dollars. Glamorous actress, Reiko. Um, a sleazy. Okay. Mitsuru Sai Sayonji. Do you take credit card? Oh, it's my mom's. Yuya. Shimano. Sea bream. Hmm. One, two, three, pushing. Quickness. Okay, cool, okay. Elegant island, rank C. Ore koso ga ono michi no shoujo. Not care you. Ono michi o da. Ore koso ga ono michi no shoujo. Nice Doko box, yeah. Actually, I need to check if I can make a new um, lodging. We can finally take Tai Chi in. Uh. So there is technically four Kiryu's, yeah. Okay, uh, let me see if I can buy a new house. Okay, we actually can. Rank C, let's get one of that. So wait, do we need like a free day to be able to 
put that. Because I don't know if I can put it right now. Uh oh. You can change it, okay. Alright, let's go check that place out. Actually, let me greet the uh, guests first. Hey, fellas! Yeah, I mean, we're gonna replace it. Okay, so here we go. Okay, there we go. Yeah, I think this is a decent placement. Or maybe... Yeah, no, I think this is good. Guests without lodging. If you put an occup... If you put away an occupied lodging, the guest will be left without accommodation. So wait, is it gonna transfer to that new place automatically, or...? Oh, wait. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, we got this, we got this. Wait, what? Wait, they should be good now, no? Can you give sake to the younger guests? I don't know. That's a good question. <laughs> you have to manually place them. So wait, this is not it? This should be it, right? Yo, Prince J, how are you doing? So now he just posted the review video. Nice. I need to check that. Oh wait, let me go clear that area first. Drunk number. anything on the hill in the lighthouse area. Good point, actually. No, I didn't. I do need to go there. God, there's just... Oh, no. Okay, I thought I was gonna get softlocked. Ah, uh, there's so much to do. Like, I keep forgetting to visit some places. I'm gonna try to go there after this. I actually don't know what to place there, even. It feels like an awkward spot. The lighthouse, especially. G Wait, you can make a graveyard? For some reason, I didn't think that would be possible. Um... Nice, Jay. Oh, 
I felt the light lighthouse with toilets facing each other menacingly. <laughs> yeah, that could be something we can do. Man, I'm putting way too much thought into this. Like, there's you guys putting toilets and fucking forklifts everywhere, and then there's me. Oh, I gotta make this look nice. <laughs> oh, we, we need a sea bream? I guess we can put more vending machines up there. <laughs> and maybe like a bench or something. <laughs> we can put trucks, yeah. That's a big sheep. Uh, maybe we can put a ramen cart up there too. <laughs> Ever thought about doing a tier list for every sub story in each game? <laughs> yes and no. People told me about that, but mostly as a joke, because imagine actually doing that. Uh, that would be like an average of 70 entries per game. Sign, yeah. Maybe we can put this up there with a the light. Nah, no, that might be a little weird. A restaurant, maybe. A Kyushu number one star. Or a cafe. <laughs> Tobacco store. Okay. Best funny sub story, etc., maybe. Maybe, yeah, but even then, how, like, how many entries would you have with that, you know? This place is tiny. What's the deal with you saying Zunbu addiction? Gym view addiction. Because... So this is a very, very deep cut. Um, a while ago... I think I think it was actually the review... Uh, or the... Not review. The reveal trailer for Dondoka Island. If I remember right. No, wait, wait, wait. Where was it again? I think it did have something to do with Dundoku, and I don't remember what it was. But... Um, YouTube caught Kiryu saying... The gym view addiction thing. And the caption said, well, gym view addiction. Um, so that's where I got that from. It's like uh, misheard lyrics. Okay, we got a cafe over here. Best OST and why is it so much more? Yeah, so much more is a bingo. Make the lighthouse a parking lot. Oh yeah, that's an idea. But like, how the how? <laughs> where would the cars drive from? And you know? Okay, wait. Let me make the car a bit closer to, to, to the lighthouse. I was so confused why he kept saying it. Yeah, now you know. Oh, 
Oh, yeah, vending machines somewhere. Maybe this is a good place for them. And another bench over there. Maybe that's a bit too close, actually. Hold on. Ooh, we finally hit the next goal. Now we just need to clear the fields. Um, the cars come from the Yuya dimension, yeah. <laughs> um, no, fill it with toilets. How about this? The ramen stand has toilets around it. So, you know, if in case of an emergency, you don't need to find um, the emergency solution. We need to put this somewhere. Maybe that's too close, actually. I think that's good. And then... No. I mean, I feel like having another one is a little much. <laughs> Looks kind of awkward here. This looks a bit more like it. Uh, I don't know. Should we? <laughs> it looks so silly to have like three. Look, you can see it in the same screen. For God's sake. They do look great at night. Yeah, but like. I think I did. Yeah, Randy. People told me it's the laser move, right? Um. <laughs> Can you visit anyone's island, or can you only visit people who only play... I heard it's not cross-platform. So there's that. Is the laser move electric again, or is it, uh, maybe it takes after the element you have for the weapon? I feel like I'm forgetting something. Most guests do not care about benches and the like. I know. People told me they just put, like, toilets everywhere, and that works for them. I just think way more than I should about this stuff. <laughs> Yo, those are big. Very speedy fishes. A golden shark? Are there spoilers or can I watch? No, there are spoilers sometimes. You probably shouldn't watch. I will appreciate the benches for them, yeah. If they need a seat, they can take one on the shitter, yeah. We need a C, Bream. Wait till you get to tier A and you won't have any more space to put stuff to make it us. Oh boy, that sounds like fun. <laughs> octopus! It's the Dead Souls Octopus! Octopus! 
Okay. God damn it. Yeah, pops. Feels bad. Dude, Leon, I just got screwed in the dungeon. A minion did a home run move and each one one shot me. I had a thousand HP. God damn. That is pretty shitty. If it comes to that case, you can put items on the beach. Oh yeah. Yeah, we can do that. I was wondering, actually, if you were able... Okay, yeah, so you can just do that. For some reason, I dismissed the uh, beaches. Oh, we have enemies. A bonded chair. I've seen people talk about this one. I guess we can just go to bed at this point. What would be a good thing to put on the beach? I guess like a food stand would be nice. Toilets give high satisfaction. I know you could be memeing, but I am curious if that is true. <laughs> Okay. The lodging is better than expected. Nice. Um. Yo, holy sh. Dude! Oh, 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 this is expensive, okay. I was like, hold on, 7,000? Or, or, you know, almost 7,000? We need a lot of gold ore, a lot of pearls. But otherwise, we can make this. Like, without even the DLC stuff. It's huge AF. Yeah, we need to probably make that at some point. So wait, if, you, if I want the, uh, if I want gold, wait, the golden trash pile gives you the, uh, the circuits, right? I think. Right, yeah. Oh, I need to clear the other place as well. 
I need to wrap up with here quick. There's a lot of bugs here. Let's do that again. Dunder Karm has... Yeah, there's a lot of stuff here. Yo, Captain Meatball. Nice. What do you think? Got a pearl, nice. Hey, buddy, I'm Muddy Murison. Here's some belly rubs or chest rubs. I like how this guy just looks like Aquaman. <laughs> A dragonfly. Ooh, another pearl. Nice. Yeah, the ending is like the one thing that will have people mixed um, on the game, I think. At least relatively, compared to everything else. Interesting to see what the grind, big grind is in the Yakuza games. Yeah. Man, I need to go back to Yakuza 5 at some point. And I know what you're thinking. Leon, fuck you. But I do need to actually max out my characters. It just feels good having like all the all the key bars, maximum health, and just everything in the game. You can quick send the storage with. Oh, yeah, yeah, I keep forgetting about that. Fish are more expensive than the ores. Truly an infinite wealth moment. Yeah. Speaking of, maybe we should catch some. I'm assuming the fish here are different from the other places. Uh. Octopus. Yo, Lori. 
One criticism I have is that if you have... Wait. You have to switch pro tags if you want to go to the other country. Yeah. Playing as Kiryu in Hawaii would have been nice. Okay, let's go back. Wait. I'm gonna go back and... Uh... Did I clear that area? No, I didn't. No, wait, 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 wait. So wait, that's at 420,000 Doku Bucks at the moment. I wonder how much less it's gonna be when I get to when I get to A. We'll find out soon. Because I didn't really get an idea of how much you save. Kiryu kicked each one out of Japan. Yeah. <laughs> Place is only big enough for one dragon. A, tr a truly Yakuza 2 moment. Ooh, nice. Okay, let me check the sign now. So, 420,000 uh, Doka Bucks. Down to... Ooh, 70,000. Okay. I mean, you save like 70,000. Maybe we should commit to the, uh... To the S-rank grind. I just hope it's not gonna take more than the next day. Once I'm done with the trash right now. But I can see it taking that long. Yeah, I think it's gonna need that long. Yeah, well. Did I greet the the guests today? I'm not sure I did. Ooh, capsule toy machines. Gotcha machines. do now I guess we can finish the dailies oh wait let's uh, let's uh, collect the uh, resources from the collection point don doku egg <laughs> if only my newer divergence was so powerful to solve all my issues with a glowing baseball bat I know right how many jobs do you think will need max stats for New Game Plus Legend? I don't know. I'm gonna assume it's like Yakuza 7, where I think one job maxed was good enough for that game. So probably the same thing here. Actually, because it's like a bit... I don't want to say tough or tricky, but like, if you want to go to 99 in this game, you will need, like, skill books. Or... Need is a bit strong, but I mean, it's gonna save a lot of time. And thankfully, if you have the big swell... Um... That dungeon allows you to just buy, you know, skill books or job books. So... As you grind, you'll be able to buy books for the last levels. And the way I recommend you do that is... Don't buy the books, and don't use the books until you're close to 99. Because that's when... The grind is brutal. 
Um, and the books, like, guaranteed, they take you your job level by one. Oh, I didn't greet them. Okay. You know what's a surprise to me? All of my characters aren't level 99 yet. They're 90, 90 to 91. But most of them have, like, their job levels above 80. Like, almost all the jobs. And still, encounters at level 20, 30, 40, um, they don't die in one hit. <laughs> So, Legend might be uh, an experience, let's just say. We'll have to wait and see. I didn't do any jobs and beat Legend. You just need to be the same as the enemy level. Okay, well, there's someone who tried. Uh, levels seem to mean less than in 7. Yeah, and I honestly, I like that. Because, again, with 7, it felt like if you're underleveled by one or two levels, you're fucked. And I don't know why it felt like that. <laughs> Did I go to. Oh, I didn't go to the lighthouse. God damn it. I wanted to get to the uh, gold ore from there. So, one thing I'm wondering about, if you place, like, a building or something on, like, an item spawn, can you just not get that anymore? If you're five levels below infinite wealth, you will struggle. Well, to be fair, five levels is a lot. But I think, like, two, three levels is okay. Again, as long as you have a good weapon, you'll be good. Otherwise, yeah, you're gonna struggle. But in 7, even if you have a good weapon, I feel like you struggle. I see, Randy. I'm assuming you can't fast travel in this. Actually, wait. We need the storage. In New Game Plus, do party members lose access to jobs like they did in 7? According to people, no. But you do have to do the drinklings again. Or... I think from the get- like, you don't lose the bond levels. So you can just... Keep, uh, keep on doing the drinklings to get everything back. The map boards, okay. You don't lose job levels, but you can't switch or put inheritance until you unlock it again. I see. So wait, do you keep basically the permanent stat buffs? That's a huge one for me. Or do like do you have to do it like seven, where you have to switch to every job to actually get those buffs again? I think I needed to... I see. Okay.
It's automatic. The jobs are automatically unlocked and leveled when they become available. Right, but before then, do you have the stat buffs? The permanent ones. Get the bingo board again. Hmm. As long as they actually make an effort to at least cut the uh, uh, the time needed to get everything back, I think that's something at least. Yeah, someone said earlier that they fixed the uh, stat buffs. I would update the game, but uh, people said on Steam it's uh, 6 gigabytes, so... I don't think that's a good idea to download that now. My internet is good, but uh, it's not like 200 megabytes a second good. Ooh. It was only 160 MB update for me on Steam. Wait, what? How is it so different for everybody? What? Is there like... Were some people sold the cut version? With the missing chapter? I think it's 6 gigabytes to unpack. Okay. That does make sense. I think unpacking is quick for me, so maybe we should do it. But also, I could screw over the stream, and like, it would take forever, and I might have to stop. Honestly, I am tempted to update. Uh, did RGG make a post on social media yet about the passion house or something? Still no patch notes, okay. Okay, I think I can see what people mean now when you <laughs> when they're talking about the uh, the broadcast being annoying. It would be nice if we, we can get it to S now, but I kind of doubt that. There's like 10 people on the island. Calm down. Yeah. I'm assuming that whole, like, how or sh uh, house shack is going to disappear when you clean the area. Or does it get, like, revamped or something? Disappears, okay. Okay, so we do need another day, but that's fine. This one is about to end anyway. 
I might turn in turn in um, early today. Matsunaga is now overjoyed. Okay. Glad he's enjoying himself. Yo, gems. No, not yet. I didn't unlock that feature yet. We can have people join once I unlock that feature. But, like, how does it work? Do you, like... Is it a code-based thing? And do you see people visiting you in real time, or... How does it work? We don't need to give Matsunaga a present, he's already at maximum happiness. Mm. Oh wait, we didn't collect stuff. Every time I think about whether or not I did something, I mix it up, I mix it up with like the previous day, so I'm never sure if I actually did that something in the current day, so I have to go and check. Uh, yeah, having the judgment cast in the island would would have been uh, nice. Uh, okay. Oh, right, yeah, yeah, we do have guests. I. For some reason, I assumed you were talking about the online feature. Day 25. Okay. Another thousand dollars. Let's see. He might look like a mad doctor, but he's actually an obst obs what obstetrician, obstetrician, and loves kids. Uh oh. We need more satisfaction for Yuya, but otherwise we're set. Elegant. When you have the space in Kasuka's house, throw some buses in there. <laughs> uh, maybe one forklift or two as well. I did buy um, a new house over there. Oh yeah, let me just go clear the uh, that one area. Oh god damn it! All right, you little poopers, come here. Oh no, not the three sixty! Okay, I'll take it. When can we add another house for more guests? Is it one per area? If that's the case, I might add a house somewhere else. Actually, I don't know if I can do that right now. Can you add a lodging on the beach, maybe? I wonder.
Nice, Denver. Now, I, the fact that you rearrange the whole place time and time again means the opposite. You're made for decorating. You have it in you. Add a lodging to the lighthouse, I see. We can put the tent there, maybe. Or buy a new, like, shot. One slot unlocks per area cleared. I see. Two lodgings allowed in the south of the island and three in the north. Okay. I'll try and keep that in mind. But I'm probably gonna forget. Okay. We can clear this now. Wow, 200 and... Basically 200,000. The number of lodgings you can build in the north has increased. Okay. Time for three stars, baby. Let's go do that first, actually. Warning, the north tourists can go to the south areas. Okay. All right. Looks like the bridge has been restored, and both the fields and the lake have reopened. And you've even built more facilities and lodgings to increase satisfaction. Plus, this place has become more popular of late and has gotten more foot traffic, which means... Which means... You pass. Dundalk Island is officially a three-star resort. Large burnable waste dump. Dunduka Island donation box. <laughs> da -da 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 -da. Finished Infinite Wealth yesterday. Need Lad 9 to be in Australia and have Ichiban fight an anaconda, crocodile, and kangaroo all as bosses. Ooh. I'm with you on that one, especially the kangaroo part. Oh, nice. Okay, clear out the cave and the forest. We, uh, once again, we already have the popularity checked out. <laughs> Dundalk Island was previously a four-star resort. I'm sure you're all dying to reach those heights again. Hi. Man. I might sound like I was joking, but Ichiban versus a kangaroo would be awesome, though. <laughs> and like, you know, boxing kangaroo, just like Tekken. And then after the fight, the kangaroo becomes friends with Ichiban. And, and uh, they become a summon, too. More effort in PR, like shooting a commercial. Oh, are we gonna see a commercial? Ooh, reminds me of the time I managed the Sembi shop. We also did a commercial for two or two. Okay. 
Someone was talking about references to that earlier. There you go. That's another one. You can now purchase a commercial time slot from Subaru. Its popularity will increase. Save up your... So I'm assuming you get more people or guests if you do that. Cabaret clubs and host clubs. And popularity, I see. Fifty thousand dollars. Uh oh. Those buffoons are getting cocky. <laughs> okay. I like how every time they show up, I give them the same present. <laughs> they never get sick of it. I'm probably gonna try to make a new one later, though. Okay, let's make a new lodging, or buy a new one. Aloha! Ooh. Well, I do have the money for this, so... Let's go set that one up. You can buy two. Okay. Um, I'll probably come back here later. Let me just install this one. Probably putting it near that view would be awesome. God, look at that view. Oh. Ladies and gentlemen, how are you? Okay. Now let's see. Oh, oh. God damn it. That's a huge missed opportunity. It actually would look so nice here. Man. Oh yeah, we can build a road, true. Hold on. Actually, that might have been a little too much. So wait... Uh, like... Trying to gauge exactly how much you need is a bit uh, a bit of a pain. Like, I mean, how much you need of the... Uh, the road you make. Um, okay, so we're gonna get rid of that... Okay. Oh, God damn it. It's so weird.
You can edit from the edge. Oh, can you? Because, like, when I tried that earlier, it was being a little weird. Okay, it seems like I actually can. Uh... Okay, we need to... Uh... God, I, I kind of wish you can just keep that and then go edit the uh, road a little bit. But no, you have to kind of... Okay, there we go. Okay, that that's pretty handy. Um... What type of road was it again? God damn it. Was it this? Yes, okay. Do an L with the road. We can do that too, yeah. But like, I want the entrance of the house to like... So you leave the house and then you see the view over there. Okay, there we go. Let's, let's keep it like that for now. Getting close. Okay, we need to put one more. No, two more. And then. Okay. No. Wait, 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 wait. So wait, I don't see a bonus. I'm assuming it's gonna be fine. Ooh. Just think, you could have saved yourself this pain by filling the place full of takeout sushi. Or forklifts. <laughs> Alright! Phallus! Look at that. Now maybe we could buy some fences. Oh, that's beautiful. See you come out here, and boom! Look at the view! Ho, ho, ho. Now that's a lodging. Um, maybe we can put something here too, like a, a table and a chair. Yo, JMG, how you doing? Man, I love this spot. I want to stay here for a while. Um, and then I guess we can put some shops here. Info booth. Oh no, not these places. <laughs> I say that because like they're so weird. You just walk in and there's signs. The announcements over the speaker are definitely an experience. I was talking about that too, yeah. Yo, Nick Bali. Well, I'm sorry to hear that. Uh, I hope you get better ASAP. Uh, okay, I'm gonna go buy the fence. Or fences, or one kind of fence. I like how one of the mascots does a World War II-esque pro propaganda over the speakers. Wait, really? <laughs> what? <laughs> Ooh. Okay, where... Oh, wait. There we go. I wonder how many of these we need to buy.
What is your live, honest reaction when no Silent Night and Infinite Wealth karaoke? Honestly, I don't mind it. Because, like, it makes Gaiden unique in, you know, having that song. It's kind of like Today is a Diamond. Um, and in exchange of that, they have a new sad song for Kiryu, you know? I feel like that Silent Night being a Gaiden is more fitting because... He's especially lonely in that game, compared to this game. Where, like, you know, it's a sad time for him, but he, he does have people with him. Yeah, same, Roxy. Yeah. I would like in Dondoku. Uh, it's pretty good. I like it. European fencing. Um. Oh, we can have these, actually. I just don't know how much I'm going to need of them. Let's buy nine for now. Oh, and then you have decorated ones. God. Uh, let's maybe get that one. Okay, I need to go check how that looks. I think I've heard of people just switching th to the English dub to see, like, what the mascots say, because, like, nobody's gonna understand this, um, if you have it in Jap- I mean, assuming you're not Japanese, of course. Uh, okay. Oh, we need to buy more. Actually, maybe having- Okay, wait, no, 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 no. Having fences all the way to there might be a bad idea, because... Um, you know, if you leave, leave the house, you might want to go to the open. Um, before you, like, make it all the way to the uh, end. Uh, okay. Actually, no, wait, 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 that's... No, you know what? Maybe a fence is a weird idea here. Make an opening in the middle. You know what else we can do? That's why I bought the, uh... These. Maybe we can put these instead. I wonder if you can walk through these. Don't know, JMJ. Okay, I think this does look a little wee awkward, but... not too shabby. Actually, no. <sighs> and then we can place trees somewhere around here, maybe. Reminds me of my house in Final Fantasy XIV. Nice. Um, let's just... Well, hold on. Maybe we should keep it at this for the time being. Hmm... 
Yeah, let's not overthink it. Okay, I just want to check. Oh, we, oh, they're solid. Okay. Maybe it's not a good idea then. Uh, I'm just going to leave it for now. Should turn these houses into Majima's villa and Kamarocha Hills. Man, speaking of villa, look at that. Trash villa. I'm gonna go see if I can make the other bridges now. to wait for the next day. So wait, we have this bridge. Oh. <laughs> Thank you, gems. So wait, we have this bridge and then that one. Must be good living there, and then, yeah, and then there's a giant trash mountain. A complete tonal shift. Oh, wait. We can just build that now. Okay. All right. Huh? So this is the cave, huh? Hey, buddy. I hope my health is going to be enough for this. I'm not here to discuss or argue with you. No dumping. <laughs> Ironic. Wish me luck, guys. I'll try and take it slowly. Oh, god damn it. No! Just you and me. Nice. We did it. It's all in the dodges. Yeah, the iframes. I do appreciate that there's a lot of iframes with the dodge. <laughs> now get lost. This ain't over yet. Yeah, yeah. That's what they all say all the time. Okay, let's see what this area has. Dark Souls gaming, yeah. The cave is now open. Break down the trash to clean up the island. How can you replenish your health? Yeah, either by going to bed early or by uh, consuming one of the... Uh, the signature food items. So, like this, I think. Or maybe not this. Maybe the chips. Have cleaned up the area you wanted to clean? Yeah, it's that one. That was the only one, I think. Why is this area called a cave? I'm hoping we can actually go into a cave. I'll check it out after this. Oh, 
So, can you actually go into the cave or no? You can, but later, okay. It's small, okay. Okay, yeah, there's a boulder. We need Chris Redfield on this case. I think this is all done for now. Yo, Suleiman. Welcome, buddy. Nice. Side Juma mini game incoming, yeah. Tadaima. Tadaima. Did I make the curious statue yet? I don't think I did. I might say for the the big Japanese building. Man, I need to collect pearls and gold ore every single day. There's something that I forget. Turtle. Ping wing. Huh? Oh, that's online mode? <laughs> He's a stray parrot Sai and I used to take care of. What a beautiful bird. Damn. <laughs> I'll deep fry you into a nugget one of these days. He's terminally online. I guess he keep like the sound is him saying online, online. I think. Wi-Fi router, USB, GPS. A gamer parrot. Check the titles. I will. Uh. Online mode. Okay, you, know, you can now access online mode by speaking to Pingwing. We'll assist you with uploading your island so others can swing by, show the whole world your own personal paradise. Okay. <laughs> so wait, is, is the bird in here? Or maybe at the other island? Uh. Dondoka farm, okay. And I have a lot of stuff in the storage. 
Okay, keep the lucky turtle. Check the promotional thing from the kid. Is the kid in the farm as well? Hey, buddy. Nice, Piri. Okay, hold on. Let me get some, hopefully, gold ore. Oh, right. The friend of the beach. How did I forget that? No gold feels bad. Can we not go to the farm from here? I guess not. Maybe you'll get gold on the farm island. Yeah, we'll go there now. We need to also clean at the cave, actually. I hope I don't forget that. Boys? I love how there's just eyes in the blackness. Okay. Master crafting. Wow. Okay. Does dodging help you go faster? I think it's not fast enough to make up for the difference. Okay, so hold on. Where is. There we go. Warning! The following info will be visible to other players. The island information, name, decorations, Sujimon info, nickname, status, party. Refrain from entering personal info or slander. <laughs> Agree? Don't ask. Sure. Doko Miles shop. Uh, completing sightseeing missions, greeting guests. For titles and avatars. Wait, these are titles right now? Hang, man! <laughs> Alright. Wow, they actually put a lot of effort into these. There's a lot of new models. These are avatars, I see. The island that never sleeps. Ladies only. <laughs> Hideaway for adults. World treasure. Hidden power spot. Street punk. Asshole. Wow. Okay. Chosen one. Fulfiller of dreams? Crazy for Kasuga. Kill you for cure you. Jungi fan. More Zhao right now. Tommy the Tommy's the homie. <laughs> Just straight up son he simp. Wow. Psycho for a psycho. I 
I love how all of these are just, you know, borderline simping titles. And then Haruka Supporter. <laughs> it's like, Die Hard for Date, Onomichi Otaku. Beautiful eyes. Actually, my stream deck is lagging again. Of course, it is. Uh, I need to replace you, you piece of shit. Your eyes. Yeah, a little too late there. Search by updated islands. Online level 16. Adachi aficionado. Live a dragon. Wow. Go by online level. Ooh. Hold on. That's gonna be interesting. Wait a minute. I recommend against coming. <laughs> okay. I was just about to ask, like, no one renamed the island at all. And then, for the first time, there's Dragon Island. I was like, am I crazy? Like, wh why does it keep saying Dundalk Island? So... Don Quixote Island, nice. <laughs> Nelly's Island. New Ganondorf Island. <laughs> Night Light Island. Stinky Boy Island. <laughs> no way, bro. <laughs> what is wrong with people? Holy shit. But of course, w w if you have a minigame around islands, this was bound to happen. Just seeing the names is an experience. <laughs> Fuck yeah, Island. <laughs> Ten years, of course. Ten years, Island. Beautiful eyes, Island. Wow, <laughs> Here, here's another one. Sheesh, people. The fact that it says Celebrity Hangout as well. <laughs> okay, we need to, uh, we need to, uh, progress. We need some pearls. We need some gold. Any gold in chat? Well, that's a gold truffle, but that's... Not gold ore. Try to visit one. How does it work, actually? Is it time consuming or can you leave whenever you want? Hut. 
It downloads the island and then you go there. You visit and you do a few tasks and then you leave. I see. I'm gonna go there in a bit, don't any spots? I don't think so. Um, okay, we're gonna visit one island real quick. Let's go to the Adachi Island. Downloading. Okay, let's see what's in here. Oh wow, you see, you just see the same avatar character. I did not expect that. That's pretty cool. Chop down ten trees. Defeat five enemies. Talk to five residents. Hey, Majima. Fight the Sujimon battle. Take five photos. He has he has places to be. Hey, buddy. Is that what they mean by talking? Or, like... Wow, the whole gang is here. Yeah, this is Adachi's island. So wait, wait, wait. Oh yeah, there is two Adachis. Bruh? <laughs> Time paradox? Okay, let's chop. What happens if you do this? File a complaint on that one. <laughs> Suspicious person sighted. Bruh. Imagine it's a scam situation and you just get jumped. I know, right? The invisible walls are kind of awkward, not gonna lie. Okay, we need five more trees. Are these guests only the ultimates? Maybe. I'm not sure which one of the additions. I did see them on the list, but I have to, like, unlock them. Oh. Yeah, that's probably the talking mission. Look! I want to build that, too. This is such a cool feature, I gotta say. Like, I had no idea what to expect, but, uh, oh. 
No one can blame me for this. Leave! Now! You're not welcome here. It's not my island, but... Leave. We need people to talk to. Hey, buddy. It takes a while to save the pictures. Um... I thought that was Tsukumo. What a beautiful view. Two more pictures, I think. Let's take a selfie. Uh, wait. Oh, he changes... Swaps hands, that's kind of cool, honestly. Okay, the picture mission should be done. Uh, we need more residents to talk to. Is that how the cave looks like? That's, that's good enough, I think. That's a gigantic statue, what the hell? It's Akuma from Street Fighter. Hangman! Buddy! <laughs> Isn't the statue from Gaiden? I think it is, yeah. Oh, wait. We got trouble! Not for long, though. Okay, we need to talk to people, and... How do you do a Sujimon battle here? Hey, buddy. A dodgy from the start, oh yeah. That's such a cool way, by the way, to kind of take the Tsujima battle thing to the next level. Okay. Oh, I'm gonna get my ass kicked. I'm not fully maxed yet. But let's see how that goes. Oh, the arena changes too. Oh, I'm faster, okay. Actually, Oof. Yeah, I'm probably gonna lose. <laughs> Let's see. Um, Shogu <laughs> Okay, it's good to know that even when they do it, it has a chance of missing on one or two of your 
スジモンさあちょっと満面が終わりました I took down two of them, that's something, I guess. Okay. I don't think. Wait, do I? Hmm. Oh, there we go. Yo, Bernardo. Yeah, it is PvP, basically. I'm visiting someone's island. Alright, this is it, fellas. This was a GG, though. Oh, wait, not yet. Okay, now it's a GG. You lose. If you're having difficulty... Yeah, I need to level them up. I still didn't finish the storyline for that. I'm at the last uh, boss, I think. Okay, we need to talk to more residents. Is it when they're only online? No, so they have an NPC that takes over, basically. You get to pick a character that becomes your avatar. And there's a lot of choices, by the way. It's insane. Uh, when you visit other people's islands, you uh, can do missions like, you know, the ones over here. And then you get points for that, and you use those points to buy, to, uh, buy an avatar and a title for yourself, too. Do we have any more NPCs? I'm assuming there is somewhere. Maybe at the lighthouse. Yuki 2006. <laughs> Koyuki 2006. Nice dude. Can he get banned from islands by banning? No, I tried that. In fact, here, Date can eat it. That's how it looks. So basically, you can do it as much as you want. If you do it on your own island, though, you're kind of fucked. Okay, can we just leave now? Oh, and it can change the uh, the time of day too. That's cool. Nice. We can afford an avatar now. Online level up. Online level up. Bra. He woo wee woo woo. Okay. See, look at all the avatars you can buy. <laughs> and then all the titles. And then a comment, I guess. Okay, for the time being, let's just do something else. Yeah, I was I was thinking of buying the Hangman Avatar first. <laughs> you know, B 
big respect to all the people who actually bought that one and set it, set it as their main. That's actually kind of funny, though, because that means if you go to that person's island, Hangman is going to show you around. <laughs> yeah, beautiful eyes is a comment. Yeah, Hangman would be an amazing tour guide. Also, I just realized we need to do the commercials. I'll go do that after this. Yo, how you doing, Lenny? Lenny. Did you try the um, online mode with the island, uh, Lenny? Where can I find S rank guests? I think the bucket list gives you a few. No? I'm pretty sure. Is it just me, or was Kiryu more muscular again in the final fight? I was actually thinking about that. Is he? Or does it just look that way? I don't know. I don't know. Commercials. Like... Inventory, of course. Okay, I need storage real quick. I'm not wrong, you get all for you. Wait, do you get them from that or from um, beating the game? No, wait, I think you get. You get the old Kiryu Sujimon when you beat the game. Yeah, I think you're right, Shivo. Okay, let's do a commercial. A hundred th bruh, take my money. Oh, not at Suka. <laughs> How was the big swell? I liked it. I really liked it. So basically, the way that works, every floor you finish will give you like a slice of life episode with the party uh, members, like an anime. Survivalist Kimura. Wow, y Yagami's looking a little different. 
Oh no. <laughs> I'm never using her. Uh, but yeah, the whole, like, man, I wish the big swell was in the game, like, base game. It's so good. Yeah, the big swell is nice, but I don't think it's $20 nice. Is that a Yakuza Tycoon game? It's Animal Crossing, Yakuza uh, edition. Uh, I'm surprised they left out so much content in the deluxe edition. Yeah. No matter how you think about it, it's all just so weird. Like, you know, DLC guests for this, I, I understand. Sure, like, sure, that's like Clan Creator tier DLC, which we're used to. Um, and then you have the DLC Sujimon, which, same thing. But... I still can't get over the name Big Swell. It's such a weird name, to me at least. Um... The Big Swell. What about the Small Swell? <laughs> they always ask, how's the Big Swell, but they never ask, how's the Small Swell? I need to make a Kiryu- actually no, I just said I'm gonna save up. Yo, zombie dude. When the swell is of considerable size. The medium swell. <laughs> Personally, I think the game was fully worth the money. Like, I agree with that, don't get me wrong. If you pay $110 for this game, and like, you know, you're a Yakuza fan, and you like to do the side stuff, you're gonna get your money's worth, but... Like, that shouldn't be an excuse, is what I'm trying to say. Because there's a lot of other, you know, turn-based games. Um, like Persona, like uh, the Trails games. They're huge games. And as far as I know, the, some of the Trails games, if you truly want to see everything there is to see in the game, in terms of story, not gameplay, story, okay? You have to do New Game Plus in at least one of the games. The, one of the Trails games. Um, and that's in the base game. Mm. I, like, man, I don't know. Ay, ay, ay. Yeah, the black records. Yep. <laughs> that's it. Yeah, Flash Jesus. Yeah, the black records are a big commitment. I don't blame the people if they just go on YouTube to see the extra cutscene. Any advice for which Trails game to start with? I... My personal recommendation is the Sky Games. Basically the start. Um, maybe it's just me, but I feel like, the, like even those being the first games, they're not unfun. They're pretty fun. Um... And they do turn based in a unique way, at least I think. And from the, you know, from the first games, they only get better. If the swell is that big, they should get that checked out. Yeah, they should. The lighthouse. Oh, yeah. Sadachi! Shoo, go on. Get you, damn boars. Oh, actual boars, okay. Um, starting with Cold Steel feels like starting with Yakuza, Yakuza with 7. Not necessarily a bad start. Yeah, basically, yeah. Um, ultimately, it's up to you. Uh, but I recommend Trails in the Sky, and then Trails in the Sky the second, uh, second chapter. Trails in the Sky the third. And from there... Mm. 
マジか And then after that,、uh, Trails from Zero, Trails to Azure, and then the Cold Steel games.、Uh... You can find a lot of people talking about the Order as well online. In case, you know, there's a lot of words that I'm saying and、uh, it's hard to register all the names. <laughs> I did Shivo in my story playthrough. I finished both. Sodachi? He's doing it for the ladies. Oh wow, they're not using. I'm surprised. I'm shocked. So. So. If you got something to protect, then do so at all costs. That's the way of the Sadachi Dojo. Arigato gozaimas. Arigato. <laughs> the Yagami stance. Oh, s u j i m a n battle? Bruh, they're gonna get their asses kicked. j i m v i e w addiction. Yo, social boner? Nice. Hope you have fun with the game. Yo, human. j i m v i e w addiction. Why am I thinking? They die in one hit. <laughs> Look at the jackets. I noticed this happens with another top as well. <laughs> Did they go away? <laughs> Sadachi's face. Wild pest appeared. Sometimes harmful pests like boars will appear on the Undoku farm. Unless you take care of them, your s i j i m o n will be able to focus on their tasks. Okay. Speak to Yui and confront them. Hi. Strange meat. Mystery meat. Ah. <sighs> Yo, welcome. I should go pick up the pearls as well. Ooh, nice. One gold ore. Maybe another one? Nah. Oh, there's the speaker again.
I guess I'll go back now. God, every time I remember what to do once I'm done with the whole day. Okay, we need to go to the uh, place we need to clear. Ye God Company. Okay. RGG should do a John Doe switch again to Souls like gameplay. What if, out of nowhere, Yakuza 9, the Yakuza 9 trailer drops and it's a horror game? <laughs> Just like complete tonal shift. Now, what kind of horror is up for debate, but imagine. Hell yeah. Man, the, the experimental nature of uh, Yakuza or RGG is something that some people might not like, but I think that's one of the best things about it. At least, you know, ever since they actually started working on it. It took them a while, too. Like, compare this to Resident Evil or even Final Fantasy. Maybe Resident Evil more so. Resident Evil had like a switch at the fourth mainline game. For this game, it took them like technically seven mainline games. And then of course, there's a lot of spin-offs in between too. Okay, guys, here's an idea, since you're talking about this Souls-like Yakuza game. What if, what if, like someone said in chat, Ichiban and, uh, you know, friends go to somewhere, and then Ichiban bumps his head on, like, the pavement or something, and then from there, he gets isekai into <laughs> another dimension. And now, now, what happens, you play as Ichiban still, but, like, He's in a kingdom, okay? And he meets people, but those people are his, you know, friends. Like Adachi, but he's like a shop clerk or something. Uh, Saiko, and she's like a, I don't know, like a, a priest, priestess. And then, you know, so on and so forth. Imagine. And then that's a full game. Ishin but canon. Ishin but a dream. So I guess yeah, Ishin but canon. Um I wanted to do something. A lighthouse maybe. Like a dragon isekai, hell yeah. Leon, when are you gonna come to Freedom Burger Land? <laughs> Man, I, I don't know. I mean, <laughs> if I do ever go there, we better do like a meetup. Like, not just between you and me. But like, you know, the, the, the boys, the gang.
Two, 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 two. You, Ichiban gets his guide into the Yuya dimension. Yeah. Ichiban in the back rooms. And Kiryu is a literal dragon in that universe. Yeah. Hmm. <laughs> gonna end up going to some anime convention. Imagine. Okay, I need to craft something. Kyushu number one star, maybe. We need three more gold ores and then four more pearls. <gasps> Finally! Manga cafe. We can build toilets. <laughs> All right. Bantam. Skibbity toilet. God damn it. Chad just couldn't tell themselves. Arcade. Hell yeah. Chicken sign. Stuffed bear. Wait, that's... Oh, I thought that was the arcade. I'll take it. Swing set. Adult shop. Uh-oh. Wait, where's the arcade? Oh. There we go. I'm running low on circuits, kinda. Why? Is that a huge statue? I'm, I'm assuming it- yeah, it is. Okay, it is. Wow, that's pretty expensive. I wanna watch so bad, but I don't want to spoil anything for myself. I- I say to be safe, just- just don't risk it. Because we are talking about the story from time to time, so... Okay, what do we do now? Figure out where to put these two. Bon voyage. Oh god damn it. I can never look at that word the same way again. Bon voyage, chat. AKA fuck you. <laughs> bon voyage. That isekai pitch makes me want to see Kiryu be a wizard that transforms into a dragon. That could be really sick, yeah. I need to craft more uh, souvenirs. I think you can. Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah, we can do that bridge now. Thank you! I forgot about that. Let me just check on the last guest. Oh, she's happy. Yeah, honestly, I would love to see them doing more games like that. Like, just... Very... Far-fetched games, basically. Give me a fantasy Yakuza game, why not? Okay. So this is the forest. Mm. And place more lodgings. Yeah, we need that. Wow, this guy really put on a barret and thinks he's badass. <laughs> uh. 
やってやるぜスピニーボーイズナイス Bro thinks he's Krauser, yeah I never thought I'd see the day I'd lose to someone other than the Cap'n <laughs> First time for everything, now this land's ours Go and tell you a Cap'n that Then get the hell off this island The captain would kill me if I did that. All I can do now is own up to my mistakes by beating you black and blue. Okay. Da, da, da. I want the cyborg future Yakuza, but with Komaki still being normal. <laughs> and it's Suko. Might as well. Okay. Forest unlocked. Let's clean this place. After the, after the reveal, AG says Bon Voyage every time he appears on the screen. Basically, yeah. Which is a shame, because, like, he does that. And then proceeds to become, like, one of the most underdeveloped characters of all time. Like, well, where's the back... Like, not the backstory, but, like, where's the development? Yeah, see, even Streamlabs is like, yeah, dude. He got a ride, basically, yeah. Honestly, even a ride had some development. Or, like, you see why he does the things he does. Being fair, though, being fair, you know, in hindsight, thinking back on it, people like AG unfortunately exist. Um, like, I mean, like, you know, you do the tiniest inconvenience to them, and they will hold that as a grudge against you for, for their entire lives, probably. It's, uh, brutal, but... There is definitely people like that. Tsuko finally gets arrested for sexual assault in Yakuza 9. Good. Take Leon's beard. Bon voyage. Mm, I'm actually not sure how much longer I want to stream. What I do know is I'm getting hungry. Maybe I should order something. The fact that he already ruined countless numbers of... Uh... Yeah, Kenja. It's strange that in the English dub they don't say Bon Voyage. Wait, they don't? What do they say then? Fuck off or something? I don't know. <laughs> Thank you. 
Yes, ready. Yes, that's that's low key one of my favorite details about um, this game. I don't know if you, if you would even call it a detail, but if you go to Premium Adventure, if you swap the party members around, they will have the you know the tag move with with the uh, leader. Um, actually, I don't know if the animation changes between Kiryu and Ichiban. That might be worth checking out. Um. Tadaima. Tadaima. I'm on day 80. It takes a long time to fill the ideas box. Uh oh. This is up. Hey, I'll take it. We should try the the other building next time. Mm. Okay. Now we need to give Tai Chi a better home. I make it sound like he's homeless. <laughs> okay, so Tai Chi, my boy, check out this house. Uh Okay. That's pretty good. And now for this. Oh, having like double the guests might be rough. We'll have to wait and see. Yeah, Rose. I didn't see those items. Thank you for telling me about it. Are you talking about these, you mean? Yeah, I did buy a few of them, but I need to buy more of them. I need to have a whole area where I can just put all of this stuff. Like the stuff, you know, that gives you extra... Um... Items. Uh, we need to buy a large one at this point. The DLC, you get so many materials, they're not needed. I feel like I'm gonna run out of materials materials soon. So, it wouldn't hurt. Especially when we get to the big... Uh, the big buildings. The hill and lighthouse. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we can put those there. Somewhere. So wait, where do I get the vegetables from? Because I installed a few of the gardening kits, but... Hold on. Oh, okay, okay, okay. It just shows up on the left. Cool, cool. Whoa, that's a big raid. Wait, can he go to the wolf icon down there? On the bottom left? Okay, that's one area. Thank you, Stefano. 
All right, you pieces of. Dodge. Okay, so I guess we do go to that wolf icon. Actually, maybe I should have used this. Uh, oh, no, I'm so glad it does show you, like, where the area is. Um... I think we need to go down there. No? Oh, maybe in the farm. Du, 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 du. I found out about that fast travel really late. Yeah, like even... Ooh. The boys, look at them. Let's get them. It's a nice uh, addition, the fast travel, but I wish it was like... on your start menu. Maybe that would have been a little too much though, I don't know. The chat fist, nice. Fight. <laughs> okay, we did it. Okay, actually, since we're here. Ooh, that's another one, okay. And then let's check upstairs. Oh, of course. Keep forgetting about the shortcuts. Mm. Nice, some gold ore. Ooh, okay. We almost can build that one structure now. You can find a bug that costs 100k. I found it yesterday in the first area near the lighthouse, actually. I think someone in my chat said, Yo, I have five stars and I didn't find that bug. Okay, I need to actually go and order something. Hold on. Let me just go to the house, maybe. True, Fabio. <laughs> okay, guys. Listen. Watch Ichiban for me. Make sure he doesn't do anything silly, okay? I'll be back in, like, five minutes.
Okay. Sorry, guys. Did he make you feel too uncomfortable? I apologize on his behalf. <coughs> Man, I love better TTV. <laughs> okay. Fellas, I just ordered some shawarma. Is there anyone in chat who never had a shawarma? Maybe you know what it is, though. A shawarma is basically a burrito, but like... ...smaller size. Because, like, as far as I know... So, you know how a burrito... Like, usually when you get a burrito... Thankfully, I had a bunch of burritos. A burrito is, like... They stuff that shit so much. Like... It, I don't want to say, like, the bread starts to break, but, you know... If it's a well-made burrito, it doesn't do that. But, you know, it's filled with, like, rice, maybe beans, like, sauce... Uh, protein... And a bunch of other stuff. Cheese... Um, Shawarma is basically just like a a flatbread with a grilled chicken or beef, and then they put some like lettuce in there and some tahini, and then like from there it varies for the most part. But that's like the ba very basic recipe, I think. Um, sometimes you'll have. Um, fries in there, like french fries, and then you might also have, I think some kind of cheese. Some of them put, like, uh, garlic, uh, mayo, you know, stuff like that. Is it the same as a, do a donor? Donor? I would say no. I think they, they're pretty, pretty different. A donor is, like, as far as I know, with a donor, like, they have a flat bread, but, like, they cut the thing in half, like, I don't know how to... I think you get what I mean. But, like, with a shawarma, they wrap the thing. Again, like a burrito, but a smaller scale. But, like, not criminally smaller. Just enough to, like, fit in your hand, like, easily. But then a burrito, like, usually you're gonna need both hands to eat that. Uh, and also, like, we do have shops here, or, like, bakeries and whatnot... That will sell, like, mini shawarmas. And that's so... Like, man, I love small food for some reason. It's so cute. Uh, but yeah, we have mini shawarmas. Y you find that, like, in some restaurants, some bakeries. I don't know about bakeries, actually. R restaurants. Um, and they're pretty cool. It's like... I'm trying to find something. Mini shawarmas are, like, this size. Or actually smaller, depending on where you buy it from. So you just, like, take one, and the next, and the next, and the next. And that's pretty, uh... It's pretty yummy. I don't know if putting the farm and stuff is a good idea here. Let me go to the other area. I need to make more souvenirs. I'm more into seafood. I'm the opposite. <laughs> I usually don't like seafood. Mind if I borrow you for a minute? Dude, this guy's still going in the background. Shut up. A campfire? Oh, that's the trailer thing. Sing and dance around the campfire, hell yeah. Okay. Well, greatly raise your guests' satisfaction. Why not offer visitors a spectacular night of memories? Campfire helps too, yeah. Okay, so... Oh, 
Oh, we can make these now. Um, oh, we can eat these as well if you want. We can make a bunch of these. Let's make one. Save that for the last day. Oh, yeah. I'll try to keep track of that one. Oh, I said hi to this guy. Yeah, mascots be like... Yeah, I'll try to remember the campfire for the last day. So these guys can't leave? <laughs> okay. Okay, we need to add something here. Leon, is this the base? Be base? Oh, wait, I can't read. The best uh, mainline game in Yakuza. I don't know if I would say best, but it's a very good uh, mainline game. What about you guys? Maybe putting a restaurant here would be nice. And a cinema. Wait, but oh, 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 I can't read. Best side game. Maybe? We had this conversation yesterday, too. Uh, some people were asking. Or, well, we were talking about minigames, like side stories, like, you know. Uh, the cabaret clubs, uh... You know, basically the major side stories. I do feel like this is the best one, yeah. Or it's up there. Because, like, here's here's the competition. The Cabaret Club from Zero. The real estate game in Zero. The real estate game... Or, not the real estate, but, you know, the business minigame in Seven. Uh, the hunting minigame in Five. The idol stuff in Five. The taxi stuff in Five. Um, now, I think... The best... Aside from this, in my opinion, is the taxi stuff. The cabaret is nice, but like a lot of the other stuff, you know, aside from this, are stuff you like you ha you don't really have a reason to go back to, unless like you really love that mini game, and I guess you want to play it again. But it's not like this. Um, who like who the hell is gonna go back and do the real estate stuff? Nobody. Once you're done with the story of that. You might go to make some money, but, like, that's it. Arcade. That might be a good idea. Actually, wait. Yeah, real estate is basically an AFK simulator. Um... Yeah, I would say the taxi racing minigame in 5 is like the best competition this has. Mm, this view is like an awkward spot. Actually, no. Let's do it. Can you buy the same kind of tile? I don't think I have that. I mean, I guess we can put this.
See? That is so weird, dude. Let me complete it. There we go. Now they have stuff to visit. Leon, did anyone try to spoil the game in chat while you were playing? Not intentionally, no. I mean... Like, major story stuff? No, not really. Someone spoiled something, but like, they, they didn't mean to. Uh, other than that, I had a lot of people saying, Yo, Leon, you know, you can expect this there, you can expect that there. Um, but it was chill for a new game. We have suspicious people. Okay, we need to make... Might be a good idea to put uh, vending machines here, too. Uh... How many stars? I have three stars. Yeah, the restriction I added, I think, paid off in the end. I made it so that you had to be subscribed for a month if you wanted to chat. So that also means if someone does, like, try to spoil, um, they're not coming back. Okay. I guess we can add this, but like, we need to clear the other place so that we actually have space here. Well, uh, speaking of, let's go there. By the way, I'm actually thinking of ending the stream when I get my food. We're at five hours now. Five hours is a good stream. a little six hour shift and you've been streaming the whole time so wait did you watch me at work or dude the food is here no way okay hold on maybe we're not gonna end the stream just yet Okay, so, if you have never seen a shawarma, I'll show you how it looks like. Hold on. Ooh. Wait, let me swap the... Here. This is a shawarma. And it's pretty damn good. Shawarma unboxing, let's go! Malgum? No, Audi. I don't like the Malgum, because it's the glow. I know. It's the. What should I say? I like the Audi, honestly. The food that you ate was okay, but if you don't want it, I don't want it. Wait, hold on. What is a shawarma? So, like I said before, it's like a smaller burrito. But also with less stuff in it. 
So you have chicken or beef with lettuce, tahini, maybe fries and cheese, maybe. Not, not always. And sometimes a garlic sauce. Not last night, no, because I work was a shit show, but I do watch at work sometimes. Well, hey, thank you for watching me. I appreciate that, first and foremost. And I'm sorry to hear about work. I hope the situation gets better. Hell yeah, resource. Let's go. We need a full stream of Arabic food showcase. I think... Correct me if I'm wrong, but isn't shawarma Turkish? But like, yeah, you see it a lot in Arabic countries. I could be wrong on that one. What is this minigame? You build your own island. Yeah, Shawarma also has an open fold, so you can see what's inside. A burrito's like completely wrapped up and uh, closed. Do an April Fool's stream but in Arabic. People said I should do that regardless. Like just a, out of nowhere, I stream something and I speak Arabic only. I did hear that shawarma is popular in Russia. Yeah. See, maybe, maybe the shawarma you guys. Here's the interesting thing. We have a type of shawarma, if you want to call it a type of shawarma. You know what we call that type? Rusi. Uh, now, normally, Rusi in Arabic means Russian, but we say Rusi for that particular shawarma. That shawarma is very long. Maybe that's where it comes from. We have two names for it, actually. We either call it Rusi or Saruch. Saruch means rocket. As in, like, a rocket shawarma. Huge shawarma. Long shawarma. Pause. <laughs> Fellas, you want to see my... <laughs> Never mind. Hey, buddy. Hey. I feel like I wanted to do something and I forgot what it was. As usual. D dude, this minigame is so overwhelming. I don't know what to do at times. Oh, well, I know what to do, but, like, I forget what to do. Tadaima. Tadaima. I just realized I have a million and a half, almost. I need to check with both uh, lodgings. Oh, wait. That's a lot of guys. Someone clipped that. Hey, for all for all intents and purposes, I could have been saying Guys, wanna see my coffee? Wanna see my Yakuza collection? Want to see my copy of Yakuza 5? Want to see my Ma Majima dollars? I actually have those. Want to see my Kiryu dollars?
Man, it feels bad for my collectibles. A lot of them are stashed. Never seeing the light of day. Yeah, want to see my big swell? The swell is... Majima dollars, yeah. Okay, dollars is not the right word. Majima yens. Imperial yens. Bro, I love that cat so much. <laughs> oh. What is up with the Drake thing? I actually didn't look it up. But I got an idea of what it is. So is it just what... Well, is it what people say it is? Okay, finally. I see, okay. <laughs> Gotta go protect the other house. Are they just chilling near the... I think they are, near the lodging. No! Oh. Dude, imagine you have to rebuild this again. Is that, is that a mechanic? You can tell me. That would suck. Okay, th those bushes are actually... ...getting in the way. It is illegal to lie on the internet, yeah. I don't know if they can actually destroy it. Pretty sure you have to if they just wait they can destroy it fully oh no okay please tell me there's no like hp for the for the house and like it doesn't recover that would actually suck Timing is lenient, okay. I think it only gets destroyed in the end of the day. I see. That is a lot of trash, yeah. That's the story of this island, though. Oh, wait, wait. Look look at that. You thought what you're seeing right now is a lot? Look at That's a li literal trash mountain. And it's steaming. Like hot poo poo. I wonder how that's gonna play out. Do you actually interact with that? Have you ever played Persona? No. Never. Is Persona 3 good? Ok, 
Okay, so this was almost a million. Let's see how much it is now. Okay. Three is good. It's so good. Mm. Four is my favorite. Yeah, I saw a lot of people saying good things about four. Aloha! Someone modded Persona 3 into 5? Wait, like the whole game? Or like, what's up? Is it like the Fallout conversion mod? Where it makes it uh, New Vegas? Okay, maybe we should go to uh, the farm. Actually, wait, that's here. Four is good, because... Sure you died and reincarnated as the protag. Oh yeah. <laughs> nice, that's two of them. Three. I still need to place the this stuff somewhere. Come on, gold ore, please. There we go. Ooh, the triple. Wow. Time to go back. Da, 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 da. Okay, maybe uh, I'll have Ichiban stare at you guys while I eat. And while I eat, I'll try to talk to you guys. Okay. See, while that happens. Meet the other Devil Leon 7. Whoops. Is there a waifu element to the game, like waifu trading cards or video store? Uh. Well, there's no hostess clubs in this, so if that's what you mean, no. The cards? Oh, those <laughs> never came back. Alright, time to dig in. Shawarmas, anybody? 
Here, my treat. Hold on, let me take the goddamn thing off. Oh yeah, Adachi is a card collector. He did talk about that. Big Ploppa versus the Big Swell. Who's gonna win? Oh yeah, I completely forgot about the mismatch. If you like the idea of like a, a Tinder minigame, you're gonna like mismatch. Oh yeah, I heard about uh, Peach Milky actually, but uh, when people said body model, I was like, wait, do you mean face model? And then I guess I learned that body models are a thing. I was also surprised to see that she follows me on Twitter. So I just gave a follow back. Yeah, I see Roxy. Look at Ichiban right now. He looks like he wants to close in for a kiss. He wants to give you guys a kiss. Is that okay? No, no, guys, don't leave, please, no! Guys, please! He looks like that homeless guy. Wait, wh which homeless guy again? Oh, oh, <laughs> oh, wait, yeah, yeah, in the beginning, yeah, he does.
I need to have a text on the screen that just says eating. Eating right now. Please uh, stand by. Leon, is this the longest minigame in the franchise? I think it's up there. What do you guys think? I have DLC items, so maybe I'm not the best person to speak about that. Yeah, look, that's me. That's me right now. Look. In chat. So, here's how I would put it. I think the Cabaret minigame, for example, um, that had more story than gameplay, right? But this is kind of reverse. There's more gameplay than story. Would you guys agree with that? Maybe? I don't know. It's not like the story is lacking, but um, the story of the Cabaret carried that whole thing. Another life, but expanded. Yeah, that, that's one way to look at it. I wonder what the party members are doing while each one is on the island. Oh, you know. Do you have to say it took like days to edit one video? I'm sure the other guys can manage something. Like Raider and Six was stupidly long with the achievement. Yeah, that is true. But like, when we talk about this topic, I try to approach it from the angle of, uh, you know, just finishing the the story of it and how long that takes. Okay, guys, last shawarma. We're almost done. Infinite Shawarma, Ichiban Imagining, Nandoka Island versus Saejima Imagining, Virtual Sukimino, who is better? Anytime a sentence or a, a, like a, a line has Sukimino, that automatically loses.
There's no game plus in this game. It will be like the one in seven where enemies deal a thousand damage with every move. Well, probably not every move, but yeah. I think you need to be at level 75 to go in, or that's that's the recommended level. And by the way, if we're talking, you know, for real about Tsukimino this time, I do like the city, but I do feel like compared to the other ones, it kind of pales in comparison. The best thing it has for it is the uh, visuals. But like, as far as navigation goes, oh my god, it sucks. Especially when you couple that with, uh, you know, the encounters and... Uh, the wonderful victory road. It's sus that they did the demo tours. Yeah, maybe they're cooking, cooking something for the next game. The return of Tsukimino, and this time it's not a hallway simulator. <clears throat> Do you think Kiryu's ending in this game is better than 6? Probably, yeah. Like, it has, you know, the characters that um, were a big part of his life, so that, that I think, automatically makes it better. Okay, I'm all done, guys. I'm just gonna wash my hands, okay? Stay! Hey, everybody! Hello! Do you think Kiryu will actually get to rest now? No. If Kiryu is not in the next game, people will cry. Where is my Kiryu? I played one Yakuza game. I need more Kiryu. I didn't mean to do that, but sure. Oh wait, I need to go to sleep. <sighs> Actually, what about you guys? Do you guys think Kiryu's... ...finally, you know... ...gonna get that rest? Hot take. Kiryu's ending in 6 is stupid. They just revive Kiryu out of nowhere. Remove. Wait, remove Kiryu? Hmm. Yeah, I do wish there was a, a secret party member. Yosh, 
I wish for him to rest, but I don't trust RGG that much. There was one argument I remember seeing somewhere about that. Oh, Kiryu is a virtual character, you guys. He doesn't need any rest. I mean, yeah, he's a virtual character, but like, in terms of writing, there's something called... What do you call it? Fatigue? Exhaustion? I don't know. But like... How much more are you gonna use the same character? Well, that's not even the real issue, but like... I think the real issue is that they try to call it with him a lot, like, multiple times. And they double back on it. does make them a lot of money, but I feel like we're at a point where Ichiban is also getting there. Dude, I need to be careful, holy shit. <laughs> Honestly, they know how they can bring him back after the ending. Oh, they'll find a way, don't you worry. They will. They will. They always do. Bro, what the fuck is like a dragon even about? Play Yakuza. Don't play like a dragon, that game sucks. Play Yakuza. You know what the funny thing is about 6 being Kiryu's last game? I think they only marketed that in Japan. Only there. Nowhere else. And yet people still know and they remember. Akiyama? Where's the Akiyama game? Where did he say he was? Singapore? And then he said he was lying about that. And apparently he found a partner and moved in with them. Singapore guy, then yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Where's Hana-chan, RGG, please clarify? Oh, you mean Desk-chan? I don't know, Kiyama works better as a side character, he doesn't really carry a storyline, he's got no intense baggage. I agree with that. Like, you know, Akiyama... Akiyama's that charismatic character we all kind of like. But... Even in his debut game, Yakuza 4, he barely had anything going on. Like, that wasn't the focus either, you know? They didn't focus on his backstory as much as they focused on how... His past ties to what's going on, and you know what's, um, what's going on with Kiryu as well. 
Akiyama might, like, if there is a game with multiple protags, maybe Akiyama can be in there, but I feel like that might repeat the same issue as 5, and honestly 4 with him. His relevance is they stole his money, yeah. <laughs> oh, and one of the one of the characters looks like his ex-girlfriend. That's it. Oh, and he loves her, of course. I need to be careful about this. No! Do I have any heals? Fuck! I was too reckless. Akiyama is kind of a Mary Sue, but we don't notice because he can do a triple running kick. Yeah. Do you lose anything? Oh. Oh, I mean, sure. We need to add stuff to the house, but like, what do I add? To Hold on. Toilets? A jacuzzi in the corner? Cars. <laughs> oh, we could add this, actually. You know what? Fuck it, let's take a piano. Try adding a public bathroom in your house that actually fits. Damn, okay. <laughs> Which one do you like more, Kiryu or Ichiban? Choose one. If I had to choose one, I mean Kiryu. There we go. Finally, we have something in the middle. Kinda. I love how that safe is just chilling in the corner over there. Not looking suspicious at all. This is actually a good setup. Not too shabby. I expanded the room once. Oh, there we go. New heart. There we go. I need to actually sell stuff too, it's been a while. How did you expand the room size? You talk to the bald guy. Um, you, uh, you unlock the thing once you progress enough. Yeah, maybe we should get the second floor. Expand. Oof. Okay, I don't know about this one. Nah, let's do it. It's a whole new home. Okay. Now I probably have to reorganize everything. It's kind of cool he can actually walk in here. I like that. <sighs> so this doesn't change. Uh, 
Oh, look at that. Okay. Maybe we can put the bedroom up here. Streamer room upstairs. Now I'm thinking all the entertainment downstairs, and then this is like Ichiban's room. Uh, we need more beds. Oh yeah, I should probably put a window here too. Put a hot tub, <laughs> bro. Uh, no wait. Oh yeah, we could change the wallpaper here too. Uh, wait. For the time being, let's put... Do we put a morning window? Or let's put a night window. Maybe over there? Maybe I should buy more wallpapers. I crammed my house with vehicles. <laughs> yeah, I've heard of people doing that in my chat before. Leon, why do you love Yakuza so much? That's it's it. a franchise I grew up with and I just find it fun. That's it. <clears throat> Um, oh man, we're broke now. We're broke. It's fun, yeah. Oh, that's sick. Okay. I should sell... Man, I have so much shit. Okay. I think that's it for now. Nice. Yeah, I'm a Yakuza in real life. Here, see, I cut my pinky. You see that? I have to live with the pain. Is that new? No, I think it's always been there. Actually, I just noticed. There's improvements here, too. Sick. Amazing? You're amazing. Our earliest memory of Mayaka's journey is when we mistakenly told my stepdad it was Japanese GTA 
and he tried to use the GTA GTA roots. <laughs> well, what a story. I think most of you know already. My dad bought a PS2, and one of the games with them was Yakuza 1. Man, imagine if my dad didn't buy Yakuza. When would I have gotten into Yakuza? Sheesh. Maybe never, yeah. I'm, I'm actually thinking the same, because... I'm gonna sound weird, but like, it's hard for me to get into games in general, and if I heard about this, like, you know, around when it got popular, then I don't know if I would have played the game. Or maybe I would have, but who knows. Yeah, this would have been a Resident Evil channel. Good, how are you? Mm. Oh, nice, human. Um. Okay, I really need to play some of these. Like, right now. Hold on. I think there was an empty space here. Dude, I... Okay, I'm putting everything here. Holy shit. This is a nice spot, but not as nice as the lighthouse. Or maybe it is. But... I have to place that stuff somewhere. Hold on. Uh... Wait. Combat. Oh, there we go. Okay, so let's place all of this... Maybe there, since the, like... Th there is a view there, but it's not as pretty as the uh, other side. So there... Um, Chicken thing. Actually, maybe closer to the entrance would be nice. Is the adventure still premium? Yes, very much so. Donation box. Hmm. This is not the place to put it, I don't think. Can you put a shooting range on the island? If it's a thing you can craft, probably, yeah, but I don't think you can craft it. I went for about five hours and he's still streaming. Have you eaten anything yet? Yes! We ate like 20 minutes ago. Shawarmas. Um, okay, we need to put the donation box somewhere. Satisfaction was easy for me, just build a bunch of stuff. Wait, you had a problem with popularity? Really? So far, every single time I get to a new rank, popularity is already checked out for me. Um. Uh. I guess we can just call it a day. I need to build more stuff for the fucking room, but it feels like there's not much.
Donation box has to be next to the road. We can do that. Ooh, fully maxed. Sweet. Look, infinite wealth. Who the hell? Do DiCaprio. Let's keep this hush hush, alright? Oh, he's a Hollywood star too. He came in secret by boat. A private jet makes too much noise. Oka. Kazuki. Yuki. Uh, I placed like 500 Majima construction hats to get to 20k popularity. Hey. Improvise, adapt, overcome. Ooh, Yuya! We can get Yuya, finally. I am not inviting Itsuko. Now we're good to go! No, I forgot about the campfire scene. I, I need to keep track of the days, bro. Someone told me it's best on the last day. Okay. By the way, what's the maximum building level? Is it 50? Did he fall down? I think he fell down. Good. And stay down there. I don't know if we'll get it to S in this uh, run, but I hope so. I think we won't actually. You think if Kiryu came back in the next game, it would be a duo pr protagonist game? I don't know if he's gonna come back. Or if he comes back, I don't think he's gonna be playable. Unless, you never know. It's sad he can't build the Sotembri neon sign. Oh yeah. Your popularity is crazy high already. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know what it is. <laughs> oh, wait. I need to check on my guests over there. <laughs> Haruto is going to be the new dragon of Dojima, yeah. He doesn't even need to ink that tattoo. It's already there. Pass down. That looks that turns into a sword. Yeah. Or a shotgun. You're only clearing places at S rank, so you get more days of Oh yeah, maybe that's it, yeah. 
Here, buddy. No more. Yeah, grab Jake here. You. <laughs> it's gonna be a reality. Now the next game is gonna be the third Yakuza Dissolution. Yeah, just wait for it. They're gonna have the dissolution of the uh, the new Tokyo Omi Alliance. Why is he looking at the bathroom like that? Mm, yes, this is a bathroom. Alright, buddy, you have fun with that. This solution, Kiwami, yeah. You know, part of me wishes the shops you place you can at least walk into. Not interact or like buy, just walk into. Would be nice. Yeah, the guy was blinking at the bathroom for some reason. Gaiden games about Arakawa and Yamai. I feel like Yamai is gonna be playable in the next uh, game with Ichiban. Arakawa though? Yeah, maybe. Okay, do you guys feel like a Kazuma game would be more interesting? Or an Arakawa game? A Gaiden game, probably, but... I'm in the Arakawa camp, honestly. Like, you know, no, no diss to Kazuma, but like... I feel like he's so boring. You know why the Arakawa Gaiden is never gonna happen? Literally too bloody. Too bloody for the audience. And we can't have it because of that. A Shima no Gaiden, yeah. And I would okay, I'm probably crazy. Am I crazy? I would take a Shimano Gaiden over a Kazuma Gaiden. <laughs> Give me Shimano. We barely know Kazuma as a character. Yeah, yeah. Like, even in Zero, they didn't take the chance to do anything. They had him in, like, one flashback, which wasn't even a cutscene. It was, like... I don't know what you call it. Kanda Gaiden with a soap land minigame. Uh oh. Yakuza Chronicles, multiple characters multiple characters with their own self-contained story. Hmm. That would have to be like half an hour stories. Actually, how the fuck would you <laughs> Pull off half an hour for Yakuza. Aizawa Gaiden, Shishido. I would much rather take a Shishido Gaiden. An Aizawa Gaiden would be boring. You know why? Because Aizawa himself wouldn't know what to do. They did Yakuza 5, that's all I'm gonna say. 
The, see, the way I imagined what you said, the Arkansas like Chronicles, there would be like a character selection. And he go in and experience a short story. But then the Yakuza 5 is like a whole game. We should probably buy a new house, but... Did the new update fix the job stats? Apparently it did, yes. Dude, wait, did they release the patch notes yet? I've been looking for those. Yeah, dude. Holy, we're at six hours already? Bruh. Oh, shit. I go to... <laughs> I go to Twitter... The top two posts are Gokudoni and Sinoius. Okay, let's see. Um, okay, Gokudoni finished the game. And it's time for him to dive into the side content. Sinoius also finished the game. But I think someone said it's a review video. Yeah, it's a review video. He made a review video. So wait. The best Yakuza game, question mark. Hey, it's up there. Okay, I, I don't think they said anything about what's included in the, in the update. Dude, where is the patch notes? <laughs> Hold on. RGG Studio. Yeah, still nothing. Maybe it's gonna be like in a few hours in like American time or something. Uh, the man who raised the patch notes. <laughs> patch notes, Doko. Patch notes went to Nele Island. <laughs> Fellas, we need someone to infiltrate Nele Island. Who's gonna do it for us? Come on. Come on, for the, for the for the homies, for the community. We need a master of espionage. And infiltration. Yeah, th there's nothing. Let's just continue. Okay. What do I have to do? Uh, look at the volunteers. I truly do have the best chat. Yeah, watch out for the landmines. <laughs> oh, look! We can make this, but where where the fuck am I gonna place it? 7,000! Maybe we can place it in one of the areas that we're about to clear. How about that? <laughs> Guys, look. That thing is impossible to place. <laughs> Three level ups. Host club. Laptop. Lamarche. Bike rental station. Espresso machine, okay. Yeah, we need to save it for one of the um, areas we unlock, which might take uh, a day or two more in game time in Minecraft. Two more days of Minecraft. I'm actually gonna sleep. Most big buildings I put into areas where no one even goes to. Yeah, missed opportunity. We ne we needed a prison that you can build. Now Saijima would, you know for a fact, Saijima would go check out that place every single time you invite him. He would ogle that shit up. Ogle at that shit. Day 32. Oh. So this is the second day. Tomorrow, we'll do the campfire thing. 
Guys, this is with me. We need another Saejima game where he gets into prison. And he also escapes. Again. Yeah, give me the whole asset of the Yakuza 5 or Yakuza 4 prison. I'll put it somewhere on the island. Don't forget that, Saito. Oh god. <laughs> Okay, we can actually clear this area, that's good. Um, a game where Saijima now infiltrates a prison. Oh, hell yeah. Subway surfers, but it's Saijima running away <laughs> from Saito. G dude, give me that shit. New stream game. And then when we switch to, to another game, we can just put that in the corner. Dude, I'm so excited to get rid of this fucking blockade over here. It's so annoying. Oh, by the way, do we have DVD players in chat? What do you guys think of the lights out mode? I tried it for the first time today before the uh, before the stream. I played Survivor. I, like I played one match, two matches. Man, I think the killer has a little too much advantage in that one. Just a little. But I like that they finally added a mode. For the first time in fucking seven years. DVD. <laughs> not DVD. DV Dead by Daylight. You know, the, the game that... The game that gets uh, one skin every two years. Well, that, that's an exaggeration, but like... There's a lot of skins, regularly, but then actual content is like every year or two. Yeah, it's good as killer from what I've seen as well. Take my money. Oh, finally, there we go. Oh... Okay, we need to put the temple... Near the cave is actually kind of cool, or it sounds cool. Okay. Oh my goodness. Okay. We can do it. I think this is good. Facing the cave. Because, like, when you come to the bridge, it's uh, over there. Yo, have faith. Thank you, buddy. Nice, dude. Success! Oh yeah, donation box near this would be nice. Need to bring that. Um, you gonna play the casting of Frank Stone? Uh, maybe? Honestly, I don't have high hopes for that one, but we'll see. The Jungi and Sony DVD Saga Brain Rot. Oh yeah, I love that. Okay, so... Give me that. So, people in the north block, I'm assuming they can access the uh, temple now? They should be able to, right? Okay, uh... Oh, it has to be, like, within a certain space. Wait, is that backwards? Yep, there we go. Hey, there we go. 
Isn't this temple the one in Onomichi? No, I think that's the same one as in Hawaii. You know, the same one you go into in the story for, for a little bit, when Jungi joins you? I think that's the one. A pa oh yeah, a pathway for it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. We need people to actually be able to visit this place. Okay, so... Um, place path. Stone road. Re... Does that work? It should, right? <laughs> Have you played the free Silent Hill game? No, but I watched the full playthrough of it. Um. Okay, that that game, I'll say, has more quality than I thought it would. But man, <laughs> the story. Ugh. Honestly, I, I, I ranted about this a lot before, but I hate how Silent Hill is just about guilt. Oh, guilt, trauma, guilt, trauma. Like, it's nothing... They've had the same song and dance for so fucking long. Like, please come up with something at least a bit original. And that story of, you know, the short message is anything but original. Um, you, yeah, you okay, buddy? Oh, attach the... Okay, okay. There we go. The, the, the writings do do like the pursuer. Yeah, I've seen people praise stuff like that. Thoughts on Patrick? Wait, Pat? That's the voice of Yuya in the English release? Damn. I don't know. That sounds a little cursed. I know Japanese fans like cult stuff with Scientel a lot more. It's why two didn't do well over there, really. I actually heard 2 in general, not just in Japan, but when it first came out, people hated that game. Because, like, it was a complete disconnect between, you know, what happened in 1. Like, it was just a completely different thing. No Harry Mason, and, like, you know, it introduced the whole psychological um, element or horror to it, like, way more than 1 had that. Like, Silent Hill 2 was mostly a psychological experience, unlike 1. So it's kind of interesting how perspective shifted. Actually, Silent Hill 2 is the definition of a game. You know how in YouTube essays you'll have, oh, the misunderstood... That. Silent Hill 2 is the perfect video essay game. I, I have a feeling that's what happened with Silent Hill 2. Video essays carried that game in the recent years. I really like 4, frustration game. I, I also really like 4. Anything except the gameplay. The gameplay is just horrendous. It's horrible. But like, you know, I appreciate what they did with the story. That game is overanalyzed to death. Oh, what do you mean? You forgot about this one door in, in like, this one corner of the city. And you know what? It also signifies something. I bet you didn't know that. You know what it signifies? See, when you, when you take a look at the doorknob and you see how tiny it is, that means James Peepee -pee is also tiny. I bet you didn't think of that. But now that you know about that, you're welcome. Oh my, the burping <laughs> nurses. <laughs> Ah, oh, classic Silent Hill 4. God. The fact that Silent Hill 4 makes you replay the whole game... ...again. Like, the second half of the game is the same areas. It's kind of brutal. This one door in this one location has very deep lore implications and might be the most important detail. <laughs> Please make an overanalyzation of Yakuza PS2 for 100k subs. I should, yeah. Oh, we finally got a kitchen table. Nice. 
Man, have you guys seen the absolute insane this for Silent Hill 2 Remake? Over stuff that's in the same fucking original game? Oh, writings on the wall. But yeah, guess what? Guess what the original had? Writings on the wall. Multiple places. The only thing I, like, I w I'll say I understand about that, like, like the criticism of the writing on the wall in the remake, is that the text, like, it, it's just a white uh, text, w white writing. In the original, it's like a bloody text, which kind of merges with the game a bit uh, better. Um, yeah, I also saw someone complain about the music. What is this rock music doing in my, in my horror game? And then someone replied to them, have you played the original? As in, like, do you even know the soundtrack they're playing? And their answer was no. <laughs> See, I'm not worried about the whole action-oriented thing, because the trailer itself is a combat trailer. So, of course, like, you're gonna see a lot of, well, combat. But from everything we've seen, the way they're actually, actually, faithfully recreating all the areas, I think is a good sign. Because if the combat sucks, then the atmosphere is probably going to be there, you know? So I'm, n I'm not here to say, like, oh, it's going to be a per perfect game, but from the screenshots we've seen, from the videos we've seen, a lot of the stuff are just one-to-one. -one. And people love that about uh, something like Resident Evil 1 Remake. Now, of course, I'm not saying one remake. This is a uh, one-to-one, -one, but... Um... When was the last time we saw, like, a one-to-one -one remake? You know? Nowadays, it's a lot of reimaginings that cut stuff out. Oh, I didn't realize about... Hold on, I need to defend that section. Thank you for reminding me. <laughs> I feel like history is going to repeat itself and 10 years later, Silent Hill 2 Remake ain't that bad, it's better than the original. You... Dude. I bet you a million dollars that I don't have right now. That's going to happen. It's always the same fucking song and dance. People love to, to bitch at first. As if they know everything about whatever the topic is. And then guess what? The thing comes out. And boom. It's actually good. Again, it's like the Big Shack meme. Ooh. That's not bad. How many guests do you have now? I think I have like... Nine? Or eight? Has RE3 Remake's reception <laughs> improved at all? No. See, that, that game is a crime. It truly is. And the reception should not improve. But I do watch, like, a Resident Evil streamer. And, like, the topic of that game does come up from time to time. Uh, he always tries to explain why people are harsh on that game. Rightfully so. Like, I do like RE3 Remake, but man... It's not <laughs> a remake. See, God, that game... That game is like one such example of how they can say it's a reimagining and kind of get away with it. So the whole idea of reimagining, like, isn't always good. Because, yeah, they can just cut stuff. Have you unlocked new ones? I think so. Oh yeah, oh yeah, don't get me wrong, there are red flags with, with you know, new uh, upcoming stuff. But then, you just have people being stupid. Again, something like the Silent Hill 2 Remake soundtrack example. Um, I think in the combat trailer they play a remix of an original track. And yeah, someone had a problem with that because of rock music. And little did he know, it's uh, music from the original, remixed.
No, I didn't do the campfire. Is this the second or third day? Hold on. Okay, it's day two. I'm gonna do it on the last day. How many hours overall do you have in this game? Hello? Oh, there we go. 162. 162. 20 of those is me. AFK, probably. Do, 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 do. It's like if they remade the Arca Zero and took out all the Majima parts. Half the game gone. It's like if they remade the Arca Zero and Majima became a support character. <laughs> Or what? No, no, wait, wait. What? It's like if they remade Zero, except instead of 17 chapters, it's now 9 chapters, or 10 chapters. Or are we making Yakuza 2 and rem removing a section of a city? paths to make the to make better use of the space. Yeah, people told me about that, but also I'm not sure if I want to use that right now. Do you have ideas? Nice, Eric. Hope that's been fun. Oh, I gotta protect the lodgings. God damn it. Here's the thing about Kiwami 2 and Yakuza 2. The core story is one-to-one -one for the most part. Except for that city. RE3 Remake? <laughs> you know, you know. RE1 Remake actually added stuff since Lisa wasn't in the original. Yeah. Kiwami 2 also added, like, the whole Majima Saga thing, but uh, I think people consider that to be mid. How do you guys feel about the Majima Saga, actually, now that we're talking about that? What do you plan on making on the second floor of the house? Ichiban's bedroom. Maybe we should have a second gaming PC there. Gameplay bad, the history good. <laughs> Bad combat. Combat is very basic, yeah. I saw someone saying they treat the original and remake REs as if two, they're two different people. And in u universe, retelling the same story. Hey, that's one way to look at it. 
but whoever that person is telling the stories of those events sure did skim a lot of RE3. <laughs> you know, just saying. tower yeah I actually man thinking back on it the fact that they just made a fucking nest too like they didn't even have the they didn't have the mind capacity to make a new name nest two <laughs> bruh Is there someone I forgot to greet? I feel like there is. Uh, um, on a scale of one to... Oh shit. Lost Paradise. How grindy is this game? Um, depends on what you're looking for. Here's the thing about Lost Paradise. Um, you had to stop multiple times in a story playthrough and grind in a not turn-based game, in an action game. Now, this game is a turn-based game. It depends on how you play. Like, if you do side content, you're going to have money, which means you get access to good equipment, and therefore, you have an easier time. In my experience... So, they only introduced the dungeons in, what, chapter 6? So before then, you don't really have to grind. You can, like, do street fights until you level up. Like, if you even do that, you need to level up maybe once, twice. That's it. But from there, if you do the dungeon, you're going to be accordingly rewarded. Um, if you're, like, a level or two levels, three levels under level, it's fine. But again, if you have the equipment, you're good to go. Mm. Tiny Mura's voice actor changed. Was he involved in a scandal? Yes. He was ac accused of uh, possession of cocaine. And then it turned out to be false. Okay. <laughs> that happened to Nagoshi's actor. Wait, Nagoshi's actor? <laughs> yeah, Nagumo's actor, yeah, yeah. Um, I'm not sure what happened with that one, though. I think... Like... He might have been mistakenly being involved in, like, a Yakuza party. But, like, you know, he was still involved. And then, yeah, the Pierre Taki allegations are also a thing. And they were real, I guess. But yeah, Narimi uh, or, you know, Tanimura's original voice actor was innocent. Nagumo's thing is similar to the Mameoka substory. Wait, which one is that again? Rise and grind. Coffee shop, wait. The cafe summon. Oh, I don't think I did that one yet. Oh. Well, the description of that, yeah, sounds like a reference to it. I didn't do that one. Oh. 
Hey, buddies. Has anyone asked what's the Yomei Alliance in Hiroshima been doing after 6? You find out in this game, actually. If you do the bucket list. Mm. A laptop. We can place that near Ichiban's bed, actually. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Tanktop is a cool name, yeah. Yeah, Ichiban can craft a laptop just like that. Because he's Ichiban. Ooh, money. So you just need gold for that, okay? Look at that. The Doko box. Uh, commercial kitchen table. We still don't have like a stove or anything. Why did the Daidoji only go after Kiryu and not Hiroshima guys? They saw the ship too. I feel like they mentioned something about them during the hospital scene. I could be wrong though. Who needs a stove when you can cook on a car engine? True. Uh, yeah, yeah. Oh, wait. We should craft that now. <laughs> We need more kitchenware, dude. There's barely anything. Didn't the whole town see the ship? Yeah, <laughs> they did. I think the politician did talk about, like, setting out fires. So I assume that, in you know, entails... Uh, taking care of the public uh, opinion. Somehow. The Ryudu family mentioned... So wait, when they mentioned the Ryudu family in this game, was it even the same one? I assumed it's not. Okay, watch this, fellas. Even in his sleep... He dreams about... You know, do I have to say it? Wait. There we go. Actually, wait, can I move it a little bit? Uh, I need to move this dude. There we go. It's kind of funny thinking about how he sleeps next to money like this, though. Also, I need to buy more, uh... Wallpapers, maybe. <laughs> Welcome back to Top Gear, mates. Today we'll be making eggs and bacon on a top... On top of a car engine. <laughs> maybe. I, I would watch that, I think. Okay. Buying this wallpaper is gonna make the room look like prison. 
Do, 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 do. This looks kind of nice. Ooh, I like this. Do, 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 do. Elegant red wallpaper. Do, 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 do. Okay, let's go take a look. Why'd you put the laptop beside his bed? Ichiban would use a laptop before falling asleep. Come on. I did visit one island, Commander. Just to see how it's like. Okay. <laughs> okay, that kind of looks like a back room's room now. Uh, this is okay. Okay, th that looks fucking weird. <laughs> um, I don't know. Which one are we feeling? Maybe the wooden one? A bit fancy for a bedroom, but hey, why not? Prison look. <laughs> Make it look like an asylum. White walls, just a bed with a laptop. <laughs> What do they call those rooms? Sensory deprivation rooms or something? <laughs> Saijim is feeling at home, yeah. Let me make some toilets. Yeah, let's see. All right. What do you guys say we go and put a shitter somewhere? Okay. <laughs> oh, God. This is so cursed. All right. You never know. Look, sometimes you have people over and they all want to go to the bathroom at the same time. So adapt, improvise, overcome, you know? We need like two more or three more. And then, if someone really wants to, to take a piss, they can just go here alone. And a squat. Dude, this is tiny as hell. <laughs> what the hell? They can chill here. Yeah, we need a TV. I don't know if we get that from like a different place, but. That's a clean as hell toilet. The dream bathroom, yeah. The whole party can just, you know, chill with each other. Why shit alone when you can shit with your friends? <laughs> Imagine Ichiban just sleeping in the second floor, and then, like, someone has to go up and, you know, do the stinker, and then Ichiban is rudely, aw like, awakened by... You know, the Agesta farm, yeah. <laughs> the real big swell was the friends we made along the way, yeah.
Oh, there is the bonfire. That's pretty cool. I don't have the guest about yet, no. I think I have like 50 of those. That's like after a while of grinding too, in the big swell. I have 20 DLC ones. I don't know if you can use both, like DLC and non-DLC ones when you craft that bat. Check out day. Let's go. Almost half a million, goddamn. Yeah, it takes a while to get that bat. I'm gonna assume that's actually better than the, you know, normal ultimate bat, because that one... God, what can it do again? It can cause poison and something else. Um... Oh, Yuki and Koyuki. Taichi with the ladies. Oh, we can bring him in now. We need a sea bream. The blind ailment. Oh, yeah. Nice. You can buy five of those things from Ben. Wait, who's Ben? Add that with a higher chance of... Oh, yeah, yeah. But, like, hold on. The thing is, you would need to add two of those, no? You would need to add... Increased chance of uh, damaging status ailments, and then restrictive status ailments. So I don't know if it's worth two slots. Maybe it is. Should I... What's the best time to grind for Dondoku? It's up to you. I didn't do it in my first playthrough. I'm doing this in premium adventure right now. Teleport to taxi on Lotus. Sweet. Oh. Okay, hopefully we can get this over with now. I managed to grind a hundred thousand dollars in Mahjong and chopped. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Bruh. You probably can withdraw that money, can't you? NPC with shopping cart, I see. Okay, how long did you play Mahjong for you to make that much? What? <laughs> God damn. Twenty hours. Oh man, here's honestly respect. Respect. <laughs> oh my god. You're you're really getting the most out of your uh, money with that. This is gonna be the first time I'm gonna grind the classes to 99. I don't know how annoying the job grinding in seven was. It's hoping it's less annoying here. Um, assuming you have the job XP items, it's not that bad. Well, 
It depends on if you want to get every job to 99. That's going to take a while. It's probably what most people would call annoying. But here's the thing. If you grind in the big swell, you earn points as you go, you know, go through. And you'll be able to uh, buy skill books that automatically level up a job of your choosing. Also, we have to fucking spend another day for this, goddammit. Uh... Nice, Rafai. Yeah, Finley. Mm, originally wanted to buy golden underwear for Ichiban, but I gave up before continuing making this story. Yeah, I think you're set for the rest of the story now. Yeah, you do need the big swell to grind. There's no reason to do combat anymore if you don't have the uh, the DLC. Do people still attack if you... I can't see the word. The heart is blocking it. God damn it. Oh wait, I talked to him already. Hey, I see you pressing the heart, whoever you are. Clear. Wait, clear? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. They do, they do. Just 49 levels good for the big swell, or should I finish? I recommend you finish the other dungeons first. I, I think for the first floor of the, of the big swell, you need to be, what, level 55? So yeah, keep that in mind. I grinded Shogi. Dude, are <laughs> What are you? I grinded Shogi and got the Desperado revolver in chapter one. My goodness. Why am I... I don't. Wait, can he actually use something for Shogi? The basics of Shogi... What does that... Does that even do anything? I do remember seeing it in games. Like the other ones. We need to buy new lodging, I think. It's about time. Tells you what the next move is, I see. Yeah, that announcer is going in. God damn. Shut up. Okay, so. Maybe we can just put another house here. If we have the space. We don't have the space. Hey, we can make this a little district, actually. You know? Maybe? Uh... Okay, we need to place a road... I kinda wish you can highlight a square. Or like a part. I 
think this was about it. Not bad. So dead though. They need to add chess. Shogi is chess. Yeah. Hmm. By the way, if you finish with the storyline of this, do you still get attacked? I see your fight. Okay. Use. Yeah, I saw that too, Commander. Mahjong table is pure BS. I can imagine. <laughs> you should fish for the lake on the right hand side. Oh yeah, I did get a gold shark before. So we can only get that one there. Dude, we're seven hours in? What? Oh my god. Man, I love how colorful this game is. Anybody else? Marlin. I still haven't seen a single sea bream. What the hell? So wait, do you need a sea bream every time you invite uh, Nakajima, or just one time? Uh... Just once. Okay. Nice.
Hey, what are you doing What's here? That? The Dundaku Scuttler. Okay, let's let's uh, fast travel. Da, 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 da. Seabream is by the waterfall. Oh, we don't have that yet, then. Uh, or we can't go there, I don't, I don't think. Oh! One time. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay, I guess we can say hi to the people first. Oh, god damn it. Alright, you gotta go take care of that. I'm actually thinking of moving the bathroom somewhere else. Mm. Oh, can you, Nova? I see. I gotta say, I do kind of like how they implement uh, the Sujima battles here. That's cool. Okay, let's fast travel. Oh wait, no, no. Did you play the game in English? No, not yet. Oh god, which beach is it? Uh, the one on the left. Okay, that's the one. Moku Beach. Uh, yeah, Spy. I like that. I haven't checked in with my Sujimon in a while. All right, let's destroy them. Oh, we have bulls, bears, and tigers this time. Holy shit. Let's switch them around, actually. Are you doing English or Chinese next? Probably Chinese, actually. What do you guys think? Bear. <laughs> yeah, I have all of the legendary Sujimon. I collected them off stream. The Chinese dub was surprisingly better than the Jap. Wait, the Chinese dub English was surprisingly better than the Chinese one. We gotta listen to that. An Arabic dub where I dub everyone. <laughs> That's just my streams sometimes. Are the legendary mods better than the free ones? Uh, the DLC ones? I don't know. I think not, actually. You know why? I think all of the Kiwami Sujimon, they take... Uh, what's it called? SP? 10 SP. So the whole bar, they consume all of it. The DLC ones, they consume like 8, 7, 6. So I think the DLC ones are slightly better, maybe. But like, they're all like crazy strong. I bought the wrong dishwasher!
Okay, yeah, let's go get the pearl from here too. We can finally go and clear that one area. Do you know where to get the dragonfish Tengui for Kasuga? I I don't know, no. I, I, like, I have so many items and I don't know. If you were to ask me, hey, where did he get this from? I have no idea. Okay, let's clear the area. Is there an item like that for Kiryu, by the way? I've been curious. I don't have one. I have his Dragon of Dojima job items. But is there like a Kiryu job item? It's the same cicada sound as, as, as every anime. Yep. They use the same one in the Gaiden uh, reveal trailer too. He only has one for... I have two for the Dragon of Dojima. From th the same playthrough. I don't know where I got to, like either of those, though. But, like... I mean, like, for Kiryu, in general. Lodgings. Okay, let's rank it up. And I might actually call it there. This went from, okay guys, 4 hours stream, that's good enough. Okay guys, 5 hours stream, that's really good. Okay guys, 6 hours. Okay guys, 7 hours. I think 7 hours is good, I do feel a little tired as well. <laughs> what can I say, this is kind of addicting. Twenty-four hour stream of Dundalk Island. When my ass doesn't become Minecraft blocks, maybe then. <laughs> but until then, you know. Next time, do it twelve. We'll see about that. Meaning, meaning you pass. This is Yakuza Eight, so go for another hour. No, no, no. We went for like extra three hours. Let's hit eight hours. Okay, how about this? We leave now, and we do some karaoke. Improve and maintain public safety. Okay. Your island must be completely safe and free of danger. The wash buckler is... Just do the final boss. That's... I don't know about that one. Oh, it's the final battle. Okay. Yeah, but we need satisfaction, I think. Easy. Okay. Okay. Uh... Oh. Dread Pirate Hook. He's got some deep-seated anger and resentment towards resorts. It is, is this time for... I can smell it. Just wait. He used to own a resort of his own back in the day. He what? It was a tiny island near Dunduk Island. He called it... He called it Zondoku Island. A nice, humble little place he ran with his folks. Even though it was small, it was a beautiful island overflowing with nature. Every night was a comfortable stay. Both the locals and the regulars loved it. But a rich man had his eye on the place and offered to invest in it one day. Sounds too good to be true. Right, in exchange for a large investment, that man proposed to develop the island into a highly profitable 
resort targeted at celebrities. Naturally, hooked, Hook opposed his, this plan, but his parents went along with it. The natural environment was destroyed, and it was made a playground for the wealthy. It lost his natural charm. Feels bad. Oh. Mm -hmm. mm. Ah. Ooh, you. Mm -hmm. There he is. I'm done playing around. Oh, yeah? Nah. Man, this guy sure is going in on a life where he just throws trash everywhere. Oh, boy, you. Dread Pirate took after he defeated him. My pet rock died at a resort, so I always hated them since that day. Yeah. Okay. Okay, let's call it a day for here, for now. I'm just gonna go back to Hawaii real quick. Did they recycle the face of Ichiban Holdings' final boss for this guy? Did they? How did you get stylish? Oh yeah, it's the host job outfit. Alright! Man. So that's my party right now. Um, character level is all 90, except Ichiban at 91. Um... S rank popularity is 20,000 points. Okay. No problem. Oh. <sighs> Let's do some karaoke. Imagine your party waiting for each of them there for ten, just 10 days. Mon a month or months even. Alright, it's time to catch gem. Let me raise the volume, actually. It sounds like a hell stare a little bit. Holy! La, 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 la. 
I am so glad that outfit is something you can select. I need to actually put that on at, at some point. Whoa! A hundred! Ichiban right <laughs> Yo, Fury. No, I took that down, because as soon as I finished from that stream, I got an email that there's 23 claims on that video. And I feel like there was a very real chance of getting a copyright strike. I looked it up. You can still get a strike if the video is not monetized, so I didn't want to, I didn't want to take the risk. Okay, you guys want to know something cool? Remind me after this song. ちんどいが食材さ。くそりと送るだけの。お前はまさにこの野郎メインです。白菜おねぎぶんたばら。どんなな地味の空より悪魔好みの大出汁が取れるぜ。They made the input so much better in this game. Okay, so, I still remember what I was going to say. So, here's the really cool thing about this. If you go back to Yokohama, and you play this song, the buttons are actually different. And I think Kiryu cheers on him. Or cheers him on. Let me just make sure. I think, I'm pretty sure that, that happened. So, technically, you have like 40 songs in this game. It's fucking insane. Let's give that a try. That loading screen, dude. Goes hard. Okay. Let's uh, let's just give that a try. See, so you can pick, I think. You couldn't do that uh, in Hawaii. Yeah, see, you have a uh, triangle now. Bruh! See, they're different. Dude. Favorite karaoke iteration. Hands down. The dishwasher... Rant changes? Wow. Hey, hey, 
It's not a hold here. What do you guys think? Should we change uh, the language to Chinese? I think we listened to one on stream before. Just one. But I've never noticed, probably. Like, man, I, I love this so much. They didn't need to do this at all, but they did. Okay. Audio. No. Do Hon oh, we'll do Honolulu. We'll do it in Chinese. I think the Chinese Honolulu is pretty good. You know? Okay. Yeah, native language time. Lower accurate gel. What do you guys think? That party night went hard. Yeah, I like it. A hundred! Okay, let's see. Let's see how the rest sound like. As good as the OG goes hard. Summertime groove. <音><音><音><音><音><音><音><音><音><音><音><音><音><音><音><音><音><音><音><音><音><音><音><音><音><音><音><音><音><音><音><音><音><音><音><音><音><音><音><音><音><音><音><音><音><音><音><音><音><音
Boys, what are you looking at? Yeah, I think, uh... Not a hundred. I think Chinese Adachi is alright. Wanna go shoot them, yeah? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, let's Judgment time. Yeah. <laughs> what the hell is that? Yeah. <laughs> 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 Okay, Ichiban really... A hundred! Ichiban, uh... Wanna go shoot them, yeah? Ichiban had such a smooth voice in this one, it almost feels uncharacteristic. You know what I mean? <sighs> okay, carry your time. Look at him, a true rapper. Just are you talking to Yuda? <laughs> hey, please! Trying to focus here. That was good. That was good. <coughs> oh, it's
，那么我要唱喽。哦 c h u n k y time. OK， 大家一起嗨起来吧 ！It's time to cry, guys. It's a cowboy、yeah. sad day. DJ Nima. DJ Nima. What Nima? Neymar. Japan. Japan. Next song is. 若人生当真，只如初见。You didn't see that blue. 哇、wow. 哦！真是孤独寂寞了。超贵的镶钻吧，银河。By the way, I'm not getting perfects anymore because I try to reach out. Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Come on! What was that? Oh, it's a sad, sad day.、Oh, yeah. Don't look, Jungi. Dishwasher time. 在意社交媒体上的那些所谓的点赞吗？是要丢掉自己吗？丢掉重要的他吗？你现在还依然觉得孤独寂寞冷吗<笑> ？Jungi sounds really good, like almost one to one with you know. Ah,、uh, what's the what's the Japanese voice actor's name? I know the name, but like. 感谢你，我唱得很开心。Okay, Zhao time. Yuichi Nakamura, thank you, thank you, thank you. 好，好，唱了。He's like, ah,、huh? you don't remember the legend? Ah. <laughs> 大家喊起来 ，woo! Yeah, DJ Ima. Sounded like Young Ye there. Japan. Next song is. 若人生当真，只如初见。Here we go. 不经意间回头看见残留你痕迹的空房间。那我来住住。Oh. 户外微光摇曳，星光。真是孤独寂寞了。超贵的镶钻吧，银河。过去回忆如同是潮水一般涌入，紧紧的困住我不。真是孤独寂寞了。Come on. 消失于温暖，后悔将那么大的彩虹五彩斑斓。Oh yeah！ 是也在抬头看，下雪会有彩虹吗？阳下的那思绪渐渐。
渐消散，总有一天，我想我会忘记这一段。在意别人的目光吗？在意社会的看法吗？在意社交媒体上的那些所谓的点赞吗？是要丢掉自己吗？丢掉重要的他吗？你现在还依然觉得孤独、寂寞、冷吗？嗯。What do you think? Who do you think has the best Hawaii outfit? Oh, that's a tough one. I'm gonna rule out Adachi because it's just the pants with like a white T-shirt. I don't know. Zhao has a really good outfit. Zhao Psycho also has a really good outfit. Sonhee's outfit is fucking hilarious because she just took out the T-shirt. That's it. <laughs> Nothing else. And because of that, I actually kind of like that. It's it's hilarious. Like everyone, oh, yes, yes, you're right. Yes, everyone actually put in some effort, and then there's Sony. Um, right from despair. Yeah, I do like Jungies as well. Do 你打算如何活下去？毫无意义的人生，要一直这样随波逐流的得过且过吗 ？Hey boy， 清醒起来，把脑子里的屎晃出去 ！Right now， 去迎接绝望深渊，燃烧吧，让一切燃烧吧，垃圾的昨天已化为灰烬，深埋进浓烟滚滚的心脏里。熊熊燃烧，不止一句。去到林下，凝为绝望深渊。我将在顶峰之间，刺破苍天。振翅高飞吧，天阙岂能在红不见？这就是绝望深渊中的 pride。找到答案了吗 ，boy？ 答案和解了吗 ，girl？ 所谓的答案，其实从一开始就已经在你们心中了。平之无味的烦恼。Yeah, that was pretty good. True, Sam. A hundred. Oh, 不愧是童声哥，唱的太。Yeah, Stefano, I agree. Man, I'm so like for all of the static songs. I'm so glad. 好了，开始唱了哟。Please shut up. Uh, I'm so glad they actually animated those. Such an upgrade. Tonight, it's time to cry again. 这首歌。送给大家。一直在坚守着的梦，那是虚伪的扎斯特斯。时钟在紧握着的手，不知何时起，也松开了它。目无情失去的时间，让我们两个人踏上不同的道路。Oh tonight， 今晚夜。Oh tonight， 依旧唉声叹气，我独自一个人，无法被抹去的回忆啊。Oh, yeah, that means I was the only guy who doesn't get a song. Oh, tonight, I will always wait for you. In this dark night, 
，感觉我似乎能见到你。我们还能否再次携手相伴到永远？永远。曾经的疼痛和泪水，再也不会去烦恼，我们一定都会化为。脸上美好的笑容。Young Yes Can， 你看。Tommy Zawa doesn't have a song, even though he can sing. So just like Yuichi, Yuichi Nakamura. People said the same thing about him with seven, so hopefully, if he comes back in nine, you know, a hundred. Oh, you sing very well. I don't know what you said, lady, but I agree. Hala, 开始唱了哟 Bakadaro time. 这首歌送给大家。I saw that, Michael. It mentions him being able to sing. Step aside, Bakemitai. Dog idol idol animation dot mp4. Where are Kiyama? Who? I don't know a Kiyama. Bakamitai. This song is for everyone. Hmm. 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 最后落得遍体鳞伤，明知道根本不会说话，强颜的微笑却又记在脸上。I love you， 也在心里口难开，我这张笨嘴实在是太失败。为什么？到底是为什么？只有再见能说得出来。醒过来吧，不行啊，这样不行啊。爱上你，爱上了，再也放不下。再浓的酒。
也只留钻心的浪，从不带回忆，脚步没牵挂，像个傻瓜。嗯哼哼哼哼，哒哒哒。Oh, don't cry, fellas. It's okay. No, no. You think the lightning of Gaiden is much better than in Infinite Wealth? I don't know. I feel like it depends on the place. I think the bar in Gaiden was actually a lot darker. It was like a spotlight. It was a spotlight, but this time it's uh, the bar is actually lit. For some reason, I think. Did we ever see Namba's brother in Seven? No. He's an off-screen character. Namba's brother and the Saejima family, yeah. <laughs> and the Yuya dimension. Why was that quiet?
How can she sing with the mask on? Zero out of ten game. I know, right? I should refund this game. I'm on the new patch and each one still stops attacking in dungeons. Wait, stops attacking? Are you talking about the thing where people said sometimes uh, characters pause for like 10 seconds? Will all the karaoke videos be uploaded? Oh. I was thinking of uploading all of them in one video, actually, but I don't know. Because, here, man, here's the thing about uploading. Now that I'm a relatively bigger channel than I used to be, uploading 30 videos a day is going to bother people. Like, shut the fuck up, Leon. Stop giving me not notifications, you know? So if I want to do that, I have to make daily uploads. And the amount of songs you have in this game, that's going to take a fucking month. Especially considering that, you know, there's different, ver like, you know, like a butterfly. And stuff like like variations. So I don't know. Ah, oh, it's a dilemma, guys. It's a dilemma. Um. Hands. He's standing in place and not attacking. That's weird. I don't know if I saw that. Who cares what the subscribers want? <laughs> the channel owner. <laughs> I don't know, I'll try to do something. Yeah, maybe I'll do that, Rain. Hands is the most difficult karaoke? Bro, summertime groove. It's actually nutty. The length of the song is what makes it hard, I guess. I feel like the voice... Oh no. Gets soft compared to the music. I think I see what you mean. You know, it's actually nice when you miss an input. Because when you get the rhythm going again, they all shout. It's kind of hype. Yeah, spy. <laughs> That's exact- that's a perfect, uh, description of it, actually. I'm glad I'm not the only one who thought so, Roxy. Say it with me, chat. La 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 yeah, Roxy. I think the one crime the English karaoke does is just like 
God, the actors actually have a really good uh, voice for the most, like all of them. Whoa. It depends on who you ask. But, but, like, the Joongi Han song in English, I love it. But then, like, in the middle, you can hear the auto tune. It's so weird. You know? Honolulu City Lights. Ta 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 ta. Oh, oh, no! No, 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 no. No. <laughs> We're doing that again. I don't know why I care so much. Ah! Huh? Huh? Brother. <laughs> why does he do that? Huh? Fucking. Lost my hearing. Honolulu City Lights. Your interjections, yeah, yeah, that's um, what I was going on about before. When you go to when you switch parties, there's different interjections. Yeah, Roxy, a hundred, a hundred. Machine gun kiss time. Dude, we need a Mexican dub in the next game. Or like a Spanish. Or Italian or French. Who's with me? Is it just me or So you know how when we were talking about the Yongye karaoke, I said like he kinda nails the soft beats. 
This guy does that for like all the songs. <laughs> you know? I feel like you should go a little harder for this song. Yeah, it's not bad, it's just... Mama! Mama! Ah! Okay, let's see how a is like. Pretty good. Okay, not bad. <laughs> How'd you get to level 90? Is there a Vagabond? There are, like, Vagabonds and Metal Slimes, but I did the Big Swell so many times that I eventually got to level 90. Like, when you hit a certain level, I think 85, you get less XP, but like, look at my job levels. The good thing about the big swell is that, you know, as you grind, the best thing you can- Oh, I just remembered something- someone said something earlier about the big swell. The best loot, if you're still here. I don't know if he's still here. So, the best thing you can actually get is- Forget about the normal chest. Uh, go for the golden ones, because those don't have mimics. And you can get like an ultra boost from that, at times. Um... The points you get from the big swell, you can just buy like skill books. So that's that saves you a lot of time. And I would say the way you should grind the big swell, get everybody to 86 normally, you know, by just going through the last floor again and again again and again. Until level uh, 86. From there, switch to another job, get that to 86, and you know. And then from there, use the skill books to, to take the levels from 86 to 99. That's what I do. Um, you don't have to strictly stop at, you know, 86, but it's up to you. That's what I do. Anyway. Yo, cupcake. Please, shut up. <laughs> Yo, Ken, welcome. Why 86? 86 is when you get um, a stat buff. And then... The next buff is at 93. It's not worth grinding that much. And then 99. That's how I did the did the math. Wow, this is actually kind of challenging. Yeah, 
来见证我蜕变。这个世界已经满。Ooh. Any specific places to get the job XP items? I just googled those, because like I was missing some of them, like the one for the pirate dancer. One of them is from a sub story. I got another one from a random suitcase. Um wanna go shoot them, yeah? Like a butterfly. Let's go. This song, song for you. Love to play, show me, show me. This is the jackpot again. Let's fly high like a butterfly. 让我全身cry。What chair do you use? My ass hurts after hours. Um, I'll tell you. Giga Chat Office Chair. Okay, that that rap is. Uh, <laughs> Fly like a beautiful butterfly. Fly like a beautiful butterfly. Like a butterfly rap is always a hit or miss, yeah. It, yeah, it is very echoey. Like, the guy is recording this in the bathroom or something. But yeah, for those wondering about... Gaming chairs are a fucking scam. Get an office chair. It's cheaper, and it's actually... It does its job. Uh, but still, even with that, you need to take breaks. Get, like, get up every hour or two. Um... By the way... Speaking about jobs earlier, so here's here's why I did what I did. Yosaka, how you doing? Um, so I get to 86 because like you need seven levels for the next buff, and then another like six levels. Um, now granted, you also need you know like seven levels from here to here, but getting from like you know. 1 or 30 or whatever to 86 is not the worst thing. Um, it takes me about 4... 5 runs of like the final dungeon. Um, the final floor and the big swell. It depends. Because like if you go into, you know, the final floor or the final stage or whatever. Um, what I also do, I, I don't just, you know, go for the exit. I try to actually find encounters. And if you're past like level... 80, I think. You can just uh, do the SmackDown f uh, feature on all the mobs. And it's very good because you basically get like almost half a million XP at times just for like demolishing them with a button. And sometimes you'll find the Metal Slime, so it's going to help you a lot in uh, uh, farming XP as you go through the dungeons. I'm doing good. I'm doing good. I, I, love, I love the game. Um... Uh, The loss of XP is worth the speed. 
Like, it's 50-50. So here's the thing. If you speed through the big swell, you're getting the boosters faster, so that's good. But you're also missing out on some XP. But it doesn't matter because you're going to come back for more. You know what I mean? So just do whatever you want. Let me actually go to the big swell for a bit. Do, do, do. I love that. I finished the game and I'm still in shock. Nice. <laughs> I hope it was fun at least. Okay, so... Yeah, there's a lot to love about this game. I, didn't stand a chance. I wish they put the taxi closer. Yeah, same, same. Get back here! Hey, you there! Hey, you there! This ain't a show, dipshit. Oh man, I kind of missed that actually. Um, because I'm stuck here for like hours now, I don't hear the goons as much. Does the ending mean no more Kiryu? They always say that. <laughs> they always say that. Okay, so. Man, this dungeon is really good because it can just farm boosters, basically. Look. Brain booster, spirit booster, guts, re ref reflex. And muscle so you're gonna probably have most of the muscle booster out of all of them because that's the floor you want to farm in but I almost want to go back for the guts booster to get more defense so like it's a it's a dilemma I don't know and there's more ways by the way for you to get boosters um, I think one of the gambling places has like boosters for like a reward I think the shogi one I suck at shogi though so fuck that um, a good way to make money fast in chapter 7. Go through the labyrinth or the dungeon. You're gonna get items, weapons, equipment, and money. I barely did side content. I finished the bucket list for Kiryu, which you're gonna unlock in the next chapter. But yeah, so I, did, I just did the bucket list and I finished the dungeons. Uh... A shogi app. I could try, yeah. So, hold on, look. I still have a few of these. But man, like, I, I try to use them equally whenever I could, but I also, obviously, I have favorites. And also, the pro tags should get more special treatment because you, you're gonna play as them a lot of the time in the story. So I try to divide them between those four, mainly. Uh, with an extra focus on the pro tags. But I did also, like, try to give everybody, basically, any boosters if I could. Just to kind of even things out. This time Kiryu is sick. He's gonna kick that illness's ass. Just watch. And then, of course, um, you can just buy skill books from here. Which is really convenient. It saves you a lot of the grind. Uh, but again, I recommend you use these at least like around level 85 or 86 or more. You can use it at 80 if you want, if you have like a lot of points. It's up to you. But I try to use it at like 86 or 7. Mmm... You know, I, I need to equip that one outfit. Hold on. There we go. This is my first time putting this on, but I love this outfit so much. Hopefully RGG does not overuse Kiryu anymore. Oh, we'll see about that. Oh wait, how do I have this? Huh. 
God, this game has so much, man. <laughs> A game about Shintaro Kazuma. A game about Arakawa. Especially after seeing that scene, you know? Game of the year, that's all I'm saying. It's game of the year in our hearts, but we know something like Final Fantasy is gonna win the actual award. <laughs> okay, dude! Oh! What did I tell you guys? One hour ago, I was like, okay guys, let's uh, call it a day. Someone in the chat was like, oh, Leon! One more hour! Here we are, 8 hours, 20 minutes. Okay, chat, we, we, listen, we can't keep doing this. Okay? We have to call it a day. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, next thing we know, it's 10 hours into a stream. Um, okay. Okay, listen, we did a lot of good progress today for the Dundalk Island. And we're either gonna finish things off tomorrow, or after tomorrow, or maybe off stream. Away from you guys, but we'll see. Um. Oh. Today has been a success, and I just want to say thank you guys for joining, as usual. I really uh, appreciate the company. I really appreciate the, uh, the hanging out with all of us. Not off stream? Come on. Okay, okay. We're going to continue on stream. Maybe tomorrow, maybe after. No, actually, wait. I'm busy after tomorrow, so maybe tomorrow. Sometime. Uh, no, thank you guys. Thank you. Thank you. I really appreciate it. Um, I really... I lost my train of thought. <laughs> thank, you. thank you guys for tuning in as always. It's always fun to just play Yakuza and talk. Um, you guys take care, stay safe, stay healthy, and all, all of that. Have a good day or have a good evening. I'll see you tomorrow, hopefully. Oh, bye-bye, guys. Bye-bye. Thank you, Varus. You guys make my day, too. Bye-bye. <laughs>